Hi, I'm Paul Mitchell. I hosted this back in 2007. Um, we're here for some sort of rematch. This is the Allies versus Octopus chess uh, tournament, highly respected nationwide. Uh, we are basically doing this so Greg can show off his ability to beat us all. Greg is, Noak is the local chess guru. Um, I'm sure you could all recognize him. At any rate, um, we are waiting for him to move, and then we are going to move, and we are going to do as well as possible. I'm here with another four players. Um, I don't know to what degree we should introduce ourselves. Basically, it's Wilt, who is... Hi, Ben. We're here with another five players, six all told. Uh, go ahead and sit down over here, Ben. And uh, if you want to say hi. Ben. Hello, my name is Wilton Strickland. I'm an attorney here in, uh, in Missoula at the law firm of Strickland and Baldwin. I have known Greg for about four years. He's a very good player for sure, but uh, I think we're capable of beating him. So we'll see what happens tonight. My name is Dale Gross. I'm one of the allies. Um, I was here the seven years ago when we annihilated Greg. <laughs> and um, I was here every year before that, and um, Greg annihilated us. <laughs> so that's all I've got. We're going to try. That's it. Okay, um, Sam, do you want to say hi? I have no idea how far. Oh, I'm Sam Sarah, and I'm a student. I'm William Davis, and I'm a student at U of M as well, and I love chess. I was here last time we played too. I remember we had lively discussions and we had a great time. So I'm expecting the same thing again. Okay. Um, let's see. Last time, I guess I get to say anything because Greg isn't moving as far as we know. Last time, Greg did the English. Oh, here. We just saw Greg show up at the board, so I guess it's. And I'm not going to bother with what he did last time if he's about to move. Um, what can we do here? Okay, it looks like he's about to move. Greg, go ahead, move. I hope I move. Yes, go ahead. Okay, here it is. Yes. Okay. All righty. Now we have to do a quick vote. I think at this point we should just vote. It's silly gabbing about theories of. Go ahead, Janet, sit here. We're now a total of six. Um, this is going to be the professional board, which nobody touches other than to move official, actually done moves. Um, I, in this, I would probably do, I don't know, pawn to d5. Is anybody, anybody else? Knight to F6. Yeah. Anybody else? I agree with Knight F6. Uh, pawn to King 4. You'd immediately sack the pawn for. Oh. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm, I'm happy to do what others are doing. The Knight F6. Okay. And how do, how, do we run in and tell Greg what the move is? Is that, the, is that the system? Thank you. I just, we, it's going to take us a while before we get used to this. We should have done a little dress rehearsal or something. We're just not that. 
Go ahead. Do I have to... Um, and I have to say, I think it's interesting that he opened it with the night after. Oh, you made it. It's good to see you. Ready? Good. We've made our answer in the first fond of What is it? Tonight they have sex. Uh, am, I, um, am I on camera? Yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. We can see you over there. And we can, I think we can probably hear you, too. Okay, that's... Do we, can can we see what he moved? Do we yeah, see? see? Well, it was. What did you move, Greg? He hasn't moved yet. No, no. Okay. Good enough. G three. Yeah, G three. Okay. Right. Um. I, I'm still for my move, or we can do any number of things. He does the English. We don't want to be on lights. What? Well, what do you think? I think that I think the D5 is good. Do a straight vote for D5. Straight vote for D5. Okay, now I don't want to make any one person sort of a gopher here, so who else wants to do it next, and then... Should we just do a rotation? Easily. Good idea. Great. Okay. Go for it. And I guess... Click there. Okay, this is all... D5. There's no way he's going to... There's no way we're going to get the clocks moving together here as we kept trying to do. Well, I sort of expected that move. That's a completely useless thing to say and has absolutely no psychological effect. Um, I couldn't see. Right, so we had D3. D3. Okay, now. That's D3. Did he do, where did he go? D3. 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 Oh, D3. Okay. Now you moved D3 the first time. Right. Okay. Um, I don't see anything defined trappy here, but let's think of it a little bit in terms of what his sort of positional acquisition is going to be. And... Is he going to do this? I think it's more likely for him to do this than this. I don't think he's going to bring this out. I don't think he's, he's going to bring this to here, but he may not do that next move. What are his, how do we control we can kind of control this because we have the knight and the pawn on. That's as good as it gets. If he does this, do we want to be able to do this? Um, in other words, we may not want to move this all the way up, but we do want to be able to get this bishop and that bishop out. So we don't really want to do this. How about G G6? You're talking about also fianchettoing. I was hoping to pick up. Fianchettoing kind of takes a sec, an extra move. He can do it because he's white, but I was sort of hoping to grab some sort of an initiative. Um, we need to castle. Thank you, but we're nowhere near ready. We have to get, we can do this with some safety. We can bring this bishop out we could do just simply a nice conservative move like this. Um, any votes? Will, you're doing very well these days. That forces you to express an opinion. Um, I would either go bishop g4 or I would be okay with c6 as well. All righty. Bishop to g4. Um, I'm not mad for that just because it doesn't really get pinned and this makes it easy to 
you know, we might get a kick back. Now, Paul, I think sometimes you're a fan of bishop to f5. Is that right? Do you like to post the bishop there? Do you think that's a good idea in this situation? Bishop to f5 here. Uh, not so much because of this. Okay. But I don't object. I mean, I often do this, believe it or not. Uh, but I often, yes, I usually go here or here with a bishop. Um, we could do that. That's not that bad a move. And we can always pull it back to here. It's not necessarily a bad idea at all. So I'll take, I'll look, I'll listen to anything. Uh, you know, basically we're still in a vague position on the game. We're not, we're, there's no, I don't think we have to worry about a defined combination against us. Do you want, how, moves for that? Do you want to see a show of hands? Or is nobody going to vote? Okay. Okay, C6 is fine. That's a that's a not against it vote. Um, this isn't bad. This is doable, and it puts some sort of extra puts makes this a really discouraging idea. Because I, I honestly think he's getting ready to push E4. All that's, right. That's an educated guess. Okay, and that's not, not a bad idea. That, that, so that's not a bad idea from that point of view. Not bad at all. And we have. Um, we have this, we have that. What else? Dale suggested Ian shadowing, but we think that takes tempo. I, w I was hoping to avoid that, just because it takes an extra move to get the bishop out. Um, so we could try we could try knight to c6 as well. Uh, the idea yeah. of pushing e5. I'm not super familiar with the variation, but I know it's I know it's possible. Yes. This is perfectly valid. That's and it's almost certainly done. Um, I wouldn't say better. It depends. I mean, we do this and this ish and this ish, and we're great. Um, who's got a defined where? We're using too much time for this. Who's got a plan? It sounds like knight c6 was very popular just a moment ago. That might be, might be the one that Dale agrees with as well. Knight c6? Do you think that's a good idea, Dale? Or? I think we ought to get ready to cast. Okay, then we don't like this. We're not going to Fianchetto in this game? Is we could Fianchetto, but I, you know. Okay, if we don't Fianchetto, we ought to, where are we going to cast him? This is this is possible for us. So if we trouble with this to get the bishop out to here, which I would love to get the bishop there, is that this That's blocks that bishop. It doesn't. It's completely different. We were playing the British, I know, I know, I know. the English then. Um, okay. We have to figure out something that's sort of a cohesive idea right now. If we want a fianchetto, we can fianchetto. I didn't like the idea because it takes an extra tempo, but he's not putting any immediate pressure on us. I, I think um, even if we take an extra tempo to fianchetto, if he were to push e4 now, it wouldn't be a good idea for him. Because that would lead to an exchange of the queens. Back to the pawn exchange in the middle. So we do have a little bit of time to play with if we want a fianchetto. All right. Okay. So, I mean, if it were my game, I think I'd do this. Are we? Are we into that? I think that's also a very C6. good move. C6. That's so, my feeling. Okay. Yep. All right. Okay. How about C5? Would that be anything in there? No, I don't like that because. Um, it's, and then. And then. If we want to get the bishop here, that's oh, good. Okay. If we want to, but okay. I, you I know, the, I see that stops his bishop. And I kind of like knight here after getting the bishop out, which I think we can do. Is there any way you can stop this bishop from getting here? And I don't think so. And I think in order to do this up, we have to get the bishop here. And I don't think that's a bad idea. As a matter of fact, the more and more I look at it, the more and more I think that maybe we should do it now okay. instead of this. 
Okay, we like this. Okay, my fault for taking so much time talking. Okay, should I run in there? Or should sure, it's two times? Go ahead. So that's Bishop no. to um, F5? Okay, we're wrecking the round the table system. Oh, okay. Okay, Same. right. Okay. Okay, this this gets done here. Okay, what, what is it, Sam? Really? The reverse London. How about that? I didn't, I didn't really think they'd do that. Okay. I'll have to give this some thought. Point edge, uh, just I guess just because it's fairly easy to checkmate with two bishops and you can't checkmate with two Greg knights. Mike goes C6. Okay, Greg might go C6. C4. 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 All right. Okay, I was thinking if he does this, I think we're better off here. If Um, now the trouble with this is we're kind of giving him this square, but maybe there's not much he can do with it. In other words, and I would be surprised if he played C4. He's never really done that in our games. It looks more like a, is that a ready system, or is that something? It looks similar to a ready to me. That's usually where the pawn is played in the ready. But um, he usually plays sort of a king's in the attack setup. So I'm anticipating a this is the there, this is there. Yeah, I think we can rule out. Okay, I have a move. What are you here? My feeling was originally this, and leave him this, or... What if we just take it? There's that. I guess, um, well, well, Mike Queen A4 check. Yeah, he's got his queen to check us, to, you know. Plus the other night coming in, oh my god. Anyway. Yeah, if, if we take him, he's not going to take here. Then we can swap queens and he can't castle. What he is going to do is check here and then whack the, the pawn, even though it's only a pawn. Um, there's this. There's just letting him take it with this. 
Um, I'm a fan of Night to C6. Night to C6. You think it's just sounder? I do. It's yeah. it's developing the night, which needs to get done. Right. And it's not clearing away one of our center pawns right now. Okay. And we don't have to worry about having the knight pinned. This is not a particularly good move with the queen. Um, I'm happy with that. I'm happy. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's good. And then he'll go here, probably, maybe. Maybe. All right. Oh, that was a fast move. All right. Okay. We're picking up speed here. This yeah. is okay. Go for it. That is. Yeah, he lost on time last time. We had him beat anyways, but whatever. Because that was three hours to half an hour. Okay, I guess we you run. I'll take I'll take a turn, but if I'm if, okay, so I okay. Okay, we have a move. Knight to C six. Really. I thought you'd take the pawn. So if he, if he does take, we could either retake the queen or the knight. And I think if we do take with the queen, we should um, take, with, uh, take with the idea of I think taking with the queen. I think taking with the queen is very dangerous. Okay, let's look at this. We didn't. We didn't look at this adequately. If we take with the knight, and then he goes here. How evil is that? Is that that's completely fried? Then we're trapped. <laughs> we wow. Okay, so maybe we messed up already. I think we did. Okay, so he goes here, and if we take move, move the knight to um, B four, and then we that can is, get that. That is that is precisely why. Well, actually, we. Yeah, I was right. thinking we can take the queen, then check and get our bishop out of danger, but then we can hit with bishop to d2, and then our queen's in danger, so... I think we're going to get forked. Um, if we retake the queen... No, he, we, can just, we can just stop it. He sees <laughs> that. He sees this much. Now, well, we should have we looked at it. Then we we, how do we fork him? What's the He's going to fork us. What's the king pawn? Mm -hmm. What's the king pawn? Move the king pawn. The king park is. Okay, yeah. he's going to fork four. us. Yeah, you said he would fork him. No, yeah. stop it. No, wait, he forks us. Okay, Good. Have a move. Okay, what's the okay. move? It was pawn takes pawn. Yeah, okay, that's, that's uh, what we were scared of. <laughs> okay, now if we do this with the queen, you see, we, he can fork us. So, that's scary. Yeah, don't take the pawn. Hey, stop yeah. it. All right, we're going to just take a look at this before we give up because if he does this now, the queen moves. Queen moves here, check, yeah, no, and the then he goes moves. the bishop here. And we got to move the queen again. Yes, I just okay, and then okay, we should have waited. <laughs> All right, um, he doesn't move too fast. Yep. Yeah. Okay, let's do. this and taking here no you can't even do the night and then how about you might have to go back to B8 so I think that one of our only options is probably to take with the queen we'll get fort um, and then oh. either take with the bishop or knight. Well, here we, we can do this. We can take with the queen. Mm -hmm. We can. We can. Just, get, um, then he goes here. Two pawns for this, for a piece. Then he goes there. 
He's that pinned. Work. That Stop work. it. That work. Nothing works till we look at it. Oh, boy. Okay. Um, his, knight be a, his knight can harass the queen by going to g5. Mm -hmm. In this position here. Yeah. Although. But at least we you saved can, the, You can push forward. We saved the bishop. Though. Well, no, well, still. If he goes attack. forward, then we put the bishop out there. We that's true. He won't. And we go here. No, that's bad. Whose move is it ours? That's correct. Okay. Don't take the pawn. That's well, thank you, but we need to figure out how to get out of this. How to, well, is the knight here? Does that work? No, no because the no, queen can come out and deliver Because he can check and then take the knight. What? We might have to push the knight back. Put the knight back to um, either d8 or... The mistake, what we did is... Yeah. Okay, do from here. Let me come over to this side and look at the board. It's a little bit easier to look at the board this way. Mm -hmm. Okay, this is this was very clever, but just didn't get us anywhere. There's nothing I can do. Um. We're going to end up with the queen out on the board, getting chased all over the place. We don't be careful. Oh, we should have picked this. This is this is bad case of too many cooks. Um, This is the situation. <sighs> Paul considered night to be a back again because. Hey, hey, Paul, I have a recommendation. Yes. Well, it's a little bit raw right now, but. Uh, Go for it. Let's see if we could set up the position where it's at right now. And. This is correct. Okay. Mm -hmm. Position. Okay, I was thinking, um, that's hard to see now, looking at the board <laughs> this way. Yeah. So we ruled out um, knight to b4 because of the check. Is that yeah. correct? Yeah. Before b5 is check. The only okay, one so I, I was thinking knight takes pawn for the first move. Oh knight takes pawn. And then if he pushes e4 to fork the knight and the bishop, right. we move the attack tonight to uh, b4. That might. So if he takes the bishop with the pawn, knight takes pawn. Check. Then we lose another knight. Aren't we, um, aren't we losing the knight on b4 to queen a4 check? Okay. I, takes said, it I said it was wrong. So yeah. if we look at this. He takes it with the queen. And then we're a piece down. Oh, on Ben's board, he has the king opposite the queen. <laughs> oh, Ben. But you need to switch squares on that, Ben. No, okay, no, that's why I didn't no, work. wait, 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 ah, wait, no, no. wait, wait, it's wrong on the white side. Wa oh, ben. <laughs> yeah, that's why I didn't work. Ben's steering me wrong over here. <laughs> do, do I wonder that what grades got his queen. Do that yourself. <laughs> All right, so scratch like that idea, it doesn't work. Faulty oh, data. All right. All right. Oh, my heavens, where's... <laughs> Okay, I think we're that did not happen. <laughs> okay, um, that's a poison pawn. Yeah, well, we've already got that right. But the question is, what do we do about it? Um, okay, this is. I'll retreat the knight back to see what happens. Uh, all the way back to zero. It's gonna, we're gonna lose it if we don't. The wars. Okay. There's got to be something. 
Uh, Will, I think your original idea was to swap down the piece in exchange for two pawns. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. I'm just trying to uh, figure out if we should take with the bishop on e4 or if we should take with um, the knight and whether or not we should um, exchange queens or try and move to queen to um, a different square to create a different threat. Um, so your first see. response would be knight takes pawn for the first um, move in the sequence? No, I don't. We, then we get four. Like, we can... The, the, only, the only other option... Um, so we can either take with the knight or the queen on um, d5. We could retreat our knight to b8. Um, that's what Dale said. That's the safest thing that, to do. That's the only safe thing to do, but then we lose Tampies. Yeah. So yes. do you guys want to... If we attack, we lose. If we retreat, we're going to lose. If we attack, we lose fast. If we retreat, we lose slow. And once again, just to, just to one last option. If we take the pawn with the queen, and then the fork follows, so then bishop takes pawn. If he takes back, we take the queen as king cannot castle after that. Yep. Um, and then we'll have we'll have two active knights actually. Um, and yeah, we'll be able to check him on d8. <coughs> At um, least that that way. I mean, it's not pretty, obviously, but we keep the initiative instead of just retreating the knight and giving him more mm -hmm. tempo. Okay. We do it. My my recommend. Well, well the well, idea, yeah, if we, can, if we can scrutinize it, is queen takes pawn. Mm -hmm. Okay. okay. That's going to be wild. No. Oh, so much no, 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 no. And there's then, a, there's and then, another really and then good if idea. Does, if he does e4, let's look at this one first. Take it with the bishop. That's just this or, one. Then bishop or, or the knight. knight. Or the knight. We, we recapture the pawn. Yeah, it's going to be with wild. With the be, pawn with which? With which? Well, uh, I guess with the bishop for purposes of this this discussion. Yeah. So I mean, it's take, and then if he takes the bishop with the pawn. Right. We capture the queen. You know, then we he capture he, the queen here. Yes, check. He has to take back yeah. with the king, and then we capture the other pawn with the knight. With the yeah. knight. And then we're actually um, we're actually doing pretty good. At that at that position, we'll threaten um, a fork on the king, the rook on the f2 square. Yeah. He moves his king over. Then we'll go knight to b4, and then yeah. we'll threaten. But also look at this. If we yeah. queenside castle, rook. it's check. True. The only thing I, is, Greg. I think we're forced into that. that. That's what the computer does. I think we're forced into it. Yeah. I think it's... Uh, so we've castled and we've checked his king at the same time at the end of that sequence, assuming he right. accepts what we're yeah. doing. I think he more or less has to. Um, so my, recommend, we're, we're, my recommendation is queen takes pawn. Now, if we want to scrutinize it to make sure we don't okay. slip up again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I don't want to mess queen up the Queen takes pawn, much. and then we can castle <laughs> queen's side if we want. Okay. Harry, Harry. <laughs> Good. Um, no, I'm Okay, it stinks, but it was our mess up, so we're. Now this makes it much more interesting. I like. Yeah, that. yeah, it is. It'll be fun. We're, we're gonna, gonna play lose. it safe. That's boring. We're gonna lose anyway. <laughs> yeah. Okay, you got it. Queen takes pawn. Well, yes. So any, yeah. any faults that anybody can see with it before we do it? Any major red flags? <laughs> yeah, there is. <laughs> well, beyond the obvious. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm I'm happy with this. Um, are you ready? Yeah. Okay. okay. So hit the okay. clock. Somebody hit the clock. You can be our clock hitter. Okay, so uh, Dale, um, I think we it's know. your turn and if you could. I, I don't want to. Oh, I, you don't I want got to. a bad back. That's right. Uh, I can do it again. Okay, okay. go for it. So, um, queen takes pawn. I don't know so why. Queen takes D5. This is the way I like. We completely messed up because this was <laughs> this was the wrong way pushed. I'm just going to run, like run the... Okay, I have a move for you. This game is going to be very interesting indeed. Queen takes pawn, e5. Well built. I expected that move. Maybe if I weren't in the room, that move wouldn't have happened, but uh, I think it's a little bit bolder. I have a move for you, late to c3. Okay, all right. Looks like you've already thought this through. Yeah, Hold I did. Okay. Oh. Because we would get a fork on yeah. him.
right. Yeah, so we, you, you all can thank me later. Yes. Anyway. You know, thank you for that. Yeah, we we yes. forget, you know, nice Greg, piece. Greg's a very good player, but yeah. basically he's a coward. I've yeah. noticed I once actually tried to lose with him, See, this is how and he refused to take it. He now. thought about it for a long time, but he didn't take okay. it, you know. Because nice I was three. actually trying to okay. lose the game. Nike C3 is what yep. he does. Yeah, and then we got to move our queen again. Mm -hmm. And we move our queen, I think. We move our queen. I'm kind of engine moving it back where it came from. We could move it here. Uh, mm -hmm. I don't see it. This often moved to this square, but I don't really like that. He can always, uh, you know, do this, but I'll do anything at this They've point. They've been putting them on D6, but I'm not sure. Um, on, on this, uh, They've been putting them on D6, but I'm not sure if that's... So I, I would say, I would say D7. With I was the idea that we'll trade yeah. off to our trade square the bishop, bishop off. for his. It's yeah. very nice having these in a line yeah. for that sort of thing. I'm, I'm yeah. for D7. D7 was my first instinct, except that this is commonly not I'm that I'm for D7. D7? Okay. So because of the D7. trading the bishop up, and we can't cross okay. the queen side if we have to. Okay. But it's, no, I, that's a no, <laughs> bad idea. Okay. Are we in <laughs> that D7? Oh, okay. Looks like a very solid move. All right. Yeah. Well, maybe I should go. I don't know. I should have gone. Queen to D7. Like a Paul Mitchell move. <laughs> yeah, he um he liked he liked Queen Queen D eight as well, but we all uh we all thought Queen D seven was probably the best. It's, it's consistent. Right. Okay, so bishop to g5. Okay. Wait a minute, what's one now? Bishop yeah. to g5. Yeah. Okay, okay. Should I do the clock? Bishop to g5. We didn't do our clock, have we? Um, no, that's my fault because we had it okay, running. Here. We had our clock running for a long time. Okay. Um, all right, okay, so this is good. So... All right. Well, that that doesn't bother me much because what? Well, it discourages pushing our uh, e pawn. We're here. We're here. It's gonna we're disrupt there. our pawn structure. Okay. Um, we can do this, and, you know, this. Pause. What? We can do this. Yeah. Um, but I don't see any reason we should trade that bishop before he castles. Um, I mean, he could. It's no big deal. Is this going to mess us up if he takes? No. Right now, no. But if we push the e pawn, it, it's going to uh, disrupt the pawn structure somewhat. Yeah. Is this then a good thing to that do? Might not this be more good. or less forces him to take it. Yeah, and it's kind that of might uh, be bad. It's kind that of like it's kind of a dual purpose move. Yeah, because then we can uh, pocket our bishop on h7 as well. Yes, if it gets attacked. by Yes, that's knight. very true. We're gonna I have was to think put of coming with... back here, and but yeah. I think this forces him to take the knight. Either that, or he loses the tempo. Yeah, and I don't I don't think recapturing with the e pawn is is all that bad. I mean, obviously it it takes. One of our points okay. off the center row, but I'm for this. He obviously cannot do this. I'm not saying obvious. I never know who's yeah, watching that, this yeah. thing because of this. It's a standard way of winning a piece. Okay. The the thing is, he he might either. I think he'll take the knight. Yes, I think he pretty much has to, or else he has to. But we don't have to do that though. So do you have any other suggestions? We can, yeah, move the bishop and get rid of his white bishop. That's the whole key. That open, can, that why open? can't we do that next move? Nothing's well, going anywhere. Because he'll do something. What can he do to possibly he'll save do us something. from? I don't know what, but he, he, yeah, he can move his knight back here. That's about do, the only thing he can do. Something. We do this. He has to move this. He has yeah. to do this first. Get rid of that white bishop if you want it. 
chance of winning. That's my only. That's my opinion. But well, I'll be all for it. It's just that you know we're we can do it. Yeah, but I mean, yeah, but the pawn is there. Let him take the knight. knight, and then we take back with one of the. I think we win development here. I think this but, is fun. But we, but I think I think Dale's worried he's going to play maybe H three or something like I that. I play Greg all the time. I know you play. have. Don't pull, don't waste time with that kind of junk because it doesn't mean anything. Let's just. Um, it don't mean nothing. No. So I guess to Dale's credit, one thing that the bishop H three move does is. Um, if he does take, we can retake with the queen. Yeah. And then it does prevent him from castling. Um and we, Yeah. Yeah, I'm not I think it's I think it's actually an okay. No, move, I'm all for it. I just say wait a wait a move because he can't really do anything to stop it. Other than something like this. Yeah, he might do yeah. Yeah, I think that I think that he actually will play H three. Okay. Um but I think that h6 is still a good move, but... And, and if we if we move h6, we're weakening the side that we might be the strong side to castle on. Yeah, have we decided where we'd like to castle yet? Or is a little no, why bother? I mean, I think we're fine. We're not going to... Yeah, we're fine until... Okay, so I think... I say <laughs> this first, and then... And then if he does something like h3, he's... Basically weakened all of this enough. Um, Don't move H six because it weakens our king side. If we can, and our queen it. side's weakened because the deep bond's gone. Yeah, but if we uh, if we do castle, um, if we do castle queen side. We'll have pretty strong we'll get control killed. No, over the no Don't don't do that. It's just silly. It's just you know. There's no purpose. I think I think this now is great. If we, you know, we can do this. That'll stop him from doing this. But if he does this, it's it's not that big a deal. I mean, it means we can't swap the long bishop, the white squared bishop. But he's going to have to, um, if he, you know, pretty much stops him from castling kingside. And it also opens up and a lot of dark square bishops for future actions. So. Yeah. When you do that, you might move the bishop back. I like, I like this. Does anybody have any feeling about that? I'll do, I'll do h6. If he moves... Say, okay. I, say, I think okay. h6. Paul, All right, I'll if run. He, if he moves the bishop back to f4, then he's gained a champion. If he moves it back to f4. He, he could move it back to f4, and he might go back to d to d If he two. moves it back, he's he's lost the tempo. No, he didn't lose, because... If he moves back, well, then do your bishop down. Bishop if he does the bishop here, he's we'll do the bishop, the bishop here. And we've developed a pawn. You're an up there. Okay. Are we all happy, except Dale? <laughs> <laughs> I'm happy. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Hi. Okay. Really? Okay. What do you mean, really? We're being very indecisive there. I wouldn't really feel that you do that. Oh, interesting. To trade those off. He thought that was a better strategy. Here you go, Paul. I guess I'm supposed to stay in there to wait for his move. Right. I'll, I'll okay. take a look and I'll come back. Okay. All right. Sorry. I'm just not. I'm just here to communicate. Oh, yeah. I have a move for you. No point in taking much longer than this. Okay. Okay. Anticipated. Yeah, okay. Oh, we got a weak king side now. Okay. 
And do we do it with the, the e pawn? I'd say for sure. I, I yeah, I think uh, e pawn e pawn is the best bet. Well, well, um, I think if we were going to take with the g pawn, we'd need to uh, calculate some really um, concrete variations. It's like I think it like it might be possible <laughs> for him or um, and, like getting the. <laughs> Basically, G takes G takes F6. The idea of getting the rook to G8 and then uh, doing a um, undermining operation with our H6 pawn, but then it um, it leaves us weak on the queen side. So I think, yeah, for I think I think that we should stay safe with the and, e pawn. Um, just take with just take with the e pawn. Yeah. Okay. I think it is possible to take the G pawn, but. Uh, you need to be um, really good at calculating. Well, well, yeah. that well, that's a good point. Taking the g-pawn, obviously it looks ugly in terms of the king's side safety, but normally it's a rule of thumb. You like to capture towards the center <laughs> right. and keep your center pawn mess. But overall, I okay. agree. I think the e-take is Okay, now I say if he does anything but this, we bring the bishop down and make Dale happy. I think we ought to get rid of that white bishop. <laughs> okay, so I'll say... Uh, but look what happened to our king's e side. Takes and, uh, e takes f6. Okay. So somebody else wants to... Well, it's Greg's move. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, it's Greg's okay. move. All right. All right. Okay. E takes f6. Yes, e takes f6. So okay, e takes f6. Well, let's see if we can guess what his next move might be. Okay, I've completely messed up with this he clock. I haven't done a thing right. In the castle, but I don't know. He might move the, the rook over to him. He takes f6. Yeah, uh, well, obviously, then I'll take the bishop one way or another. Mm -hmm. take, it, take, it with, take it with the e pawn. He takes. Is that the move? Yeah. Oh, you're, you're, the, you're the ambassador. I'm the, I'm, I'm the messenger. Mm -hmm. Okay, they, this is the official move. The official move right there. Okay. He takes f6. You got five minutes on your clock. <laughs> By the same token, it's a very solid structure. It's In this something. case, because they're all connected and they're they're just good. Mm -hmm. All right. Now we have the two bishops. We have slightly messy pawns. We're basically well Greg, off. I don't think Greg, Greg will. That doesn't bother me. We do it. Do we do what you say. There's what yes. he might do. Yes, that he might and that do. That would be the best move, I'd say. But which move are you talking about here? I don't yeah, know if he'll I was do thinking, it. Um, I don't know if he'll do it. But yeah, he'll he'll. If he does do this, that. I say we do that. But whatever. Go but for um, it. he's gonna have tr sort of trouble um, castling, casting safely with move like h3, um, then getting his bishop to g2, and then um, if he castles, we've got he two can. attackers on h3. Um, That's true. So, he has to keep the bishop yeah, and the rook so, like, on that. I actually pawn. think um, his plan may be h3. Um, G4 or some sort of knight move to um, attack our bishop. But, yeah, um, except for a weakened trade off. That's what he don't want, I bet you. But I don't know. I don't know. He's, yeah, wrecked, have, our, um, he's wrecked our king side. No, it side. isn't wrecked. Our, it's not wrecked. Uh, we can castle there easily. Bombs. No, I know, but the pawn structure on the king side isn't. It's not ideal, but it's not mm -hmm. wrecked. It's, we're in great shape there. We're actually, I think we're in pretty good shape. Now, I recommend Dale read Aaron Nimzovich's book, My System, where, <laughs> where he talks about double pawns and how they are not necessarily bad, especially when no, they're No, it's not the home. double pawns, it's this. Yeah, see this one here? Hmm. That would make it stronger than here. Oh, okay. That's so, what I'm saying. This is good. Uh, this would be great. He'd never get in there. So if the double pawns don't trouble you, just the No, it's the just, pawn it's on, just on says. H6. It okay. says. Yeah. So I think that... Because, um, look, he's he's, clo it's, he's closer. Anyway, we'll see what happens. I don't actually think our uh, H6 pawn is uh, really that weak. It's already mm -hmm. defended by G7. I like doing H. I love H6. Light squares that were um, 
sort of like the uh, light square on G6 that was left behind by going yeah, to H6 is actually not that big of a deal because we still have our light square bishop. And so, like, yeah, I think that's another reason why. Yeah, which is traded off hopefully. Yeah. And again, <laughs> this do is not have to trade off. And, and that pawn move on h6 <laughs> is fairly standard when you bring the bishop out there. It's an escape hatch for the bishop. Yes. Yeah, so there's nothing wrong yeah, with this that. Is, I like doing it. If he does this, but, I say bishop here next, but there's nothing wrong with this. Yeah. That's or good. this. That's good. Because job. this tends to. Right. You know, that so, might. so I think Dale's fears, oh, they might be somewhat justified. I don't think they're that serious. <laughs> but. <laughs> I'm so you need to relax a little bit. <laughs> okay. <laughs> you guys are braver than I am. <laughs> Here's a pun. Queen B3. Whoa! Yes, let's be sure to hit the clock. We're probably already a little bit there out of sync. Here guys. <laughs> this is getting exciting. All right. Okay, so now he has brought out the queen. He's attacking the pawn on B7. Okay. Okay, so... The, yeah, and then if we... Cast now, it. you know, thi this is traditionally a poison pawn. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Um, we got to get our bishop out eventually. Let's think about his taking that and then just doing this. Yeah. Thing is, uh, because And he then he loses this. Mm-hmm. I don't think I don't think he's going to take this. Is he just doing pressure yeah. here? Is he trying well, to? Well, we can't castle queen. Oh well, yeah, we could. We could trade queens, or put the bishop to the to chase his queen away. I still I kind think of like trade. this. I was. That's a good idea. Yeah. We got to get the bishop developed. Yeah, yeah, and then it can go back. Are there any thoughts on uh, bishop to b4, pending the knight to the king, or is that? Seem not as good. That's a good idea too. Except to bishop to b four. Yeah. No. One, or did one, you, did one you like that idea? Yeah. No. One more here. Correct. I just hadn't thought of that. Let's just, just in terms of maybe trading down, because with Greg, the more you can trade down, probably the better. <laughs> but yeah. that's just All my right. philosophy. And then if he does this, we just take the knight. Take the knight, yeah. And then he's messed up. Okay. It's just that I would like to try to hold on to the. Um, That's true. It is an advantage. It's a dark square bishop, and he does not have his. Right. So Paul doesn't want to get rid of if, it. Yet. If, if it's easy. Um, That's a good one too. We got a lot of he, ammunition on this for the time being. The pawn, we'll of course, see. he does have. If this really doesn't worry me. I think you can do this. He has to go here. You go. And then we could castle on Queensland. You go rook here. I mean on Kingsland. He has to come here. Get moving our bishop, I think, is our best move, and we might lose a pawn, but And we do of course have this. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. I don't think he'll he might not take that pawn, guys. So I think that um, move the bishop and then we can castle. Yeah, we should rule out bishop h three, because if the bishop takes um, bishop takes h three, queen takes h three. Um, he can actually just come in and take b7 with his queen, and then our knight's hanging, and our rook's hanging, and then we lose. I'm sorry, we should rule out this. Yeah, because if he takes because the Because if he takes... Then the queen gets drawn away. The queen gets drawn away, and he does... Queen takes pawn after the queen is gone, mm -hmm. out of the picture. Yeah, and, and then we can should, put our queen right on. Well, you can now uh, take this, is what you're saying. Yes, that's what Will was. Yeah, you're absolutely correct. Yeah, so I think the so that's the page a, three is just a may have actually crudely. done that in order to avoid our shutting yeah, up. Yeah, he'll try trap. to save his bishop. I'll bet. Okay. Maybe he won't. So we, we have push. bishop here. We have bishop here. I kind of yeah, I can get the, into bishop there. I'm not to anti B6. it. We could go to b six. Well, that, is, that would stop that whole, whole I don't it's think really that's a problem. I don't think, if we, I think we are very happy if he does that. We just bring the, mm, the rook I over. I'm not sure he'll take the point. And you can take this, and he's really in trouble in terms of, um, we can do bishop here. Maybe we're winning again. Ah. Stop it. 
we can do here, we can stay on point like normal people. We can go here with the bishop. We can go here. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to stay close. This is actually kind of good. Cause I, I'm a fan of that. Uh, that's that's my idea. Okay. I think that's a good one, but I'm open to suggestions. And it's here. Okay, yeah. So I think um, I, I think with um, something like bishop c5, we're going to, like, if he, like, if we do do that and he goes knight to a4, we should consider taking our bishop back to e7. Or actually, I guess, um, yeah, yeah. We should uh, consider going back to e7 just because, um, yeah, he'll be able to, t to uh, take it on b6. And uh, if we sort of want to preserve the um, bishop pair. Are you saying if we go here and he goes here? No, no, the knight. The knight goes to a4. Knight goes to a4. Oh, boy. Well, that is that. That's bad for us. Is yeah. it? Because then, then he can develop his rook and. and and he's developed. That's true. So once again, yeah, that's we want to avoid that. Yeah, we don't move that. bishop to b4, and it's in the butt. Okay. Hmm. We're okay. Yeah. Is that is everybody happy with bishop to b4? Yeah. Okay. okay. I. Okay. Um, I would tell. Them. Yeah, I guess it's short of your turn mm -hmm. if you yeah. have yeah. Uh, yeah. turns. Uh, At least we're getting it developed. Too. Okay, this is actually yeah, this is much yeah. more pleasant than the last time. <laughs> We're going to pick up... Uh, yeah. So when was the last time there was a program like this? I think it was seven years ago. I've got it on tape. I'd be yeah. happy to show, spread it around. Okay. That is a good good move, maybe. Thank you. I think so, too. <laughs> I'm just kidding. No, it's a good move to get rid of that night and then get our queen to go on. No. It's okay, Greg's a tough player. I'm glad I took Aspen before I came out. <laughs> okay, who's, whose move is it now, Greg? Yes. It's a bishop to G2. Oh, boy. We now, now, do it, do it. Get rid of that bishop. Okay. I think this is happy. We've had it almost. Get rid of the frickin' bishop. Okay, and, like, and like, uh, Getting rid of the light square bishop still won't work in this case, because he can, um, yeah. So bishop, bishop h3, bishop takes h3, queen takes h3. Or actually, never mind. It actually, actually might work. Here's what Greg can do. Bishop is here. Never mind. What's your what, you what's your see a trap? Oh, Pretend we do mind. Greg's got a trap. Okay. Yeah. Well, I can't actually see too many faults with it because you, our you, you get a queen down here and the bishops are off the board. Uh huh. Yeah. So because our bishop on, well, okay. Yeah, because our bishop. Oh, this is this this is going to get complicated. Yeah. Let me. Um, if he moves the knight here, our queen's in danger. We have to get rid of the knight. The bishop can take the. His bishop can take our knight, and then his queen can take our bishop. Dale's expressing concern over knight e5. There's traps. By, by Greg. There's knight traps. e5. He's worried about that. Well, yeah. He yeah, goes knight, to, knight to e5. This he can go yeah, Dale is Oh, we can check him though. First. Wait a minute, I want to know. Knight to Never e5. mind. Knight to e5. Forget it. That's what Dale He was can check before. us first. Where is our bishop? Well, we yeah. just, but there's a pawn. We can take him, is there? I know, that's why I didn't understand why he said that, but that's what he said. No, he can check <laughs> us, but no, if he didn't, it's a trap. If he, we can check him, though. Then okay. We win. He okay. won't do it. Is there anything wrong with this? All right, so I yes. guess yes. my so problem. What's wrong with that? The pawn, pawn, exactly. pawn to a3 chases the bishop, and uh, and then the queen gets here. Well, not if we exchange on c3. I wait. think to get oh. rid of his wife. Yeah, there, you but I was, I was, I was, I was looking at the exact same steps. thing. I, I thought it was. You would exchange here. Yeah, so um, we're basically right. um, trading our dark square bishop for the knight on c3 you if see, we go bishop to h3. You see how the, slip, okay. the white square? I, I do, but let's okay. just have one person at a time. Okay, okay. we're all right. Uh, because of the move a3 after um, our queen retakes on h3. Okay. Yeah. Don't us take. Yeah, right. Now, okay. now, now we got it. He can't so cancel. So now he goes move. h3? Yeah, yeah, and then he's no. in even worse shape. We got it if we started that bishop. We I think nothing wrong with this. Okay. Okay, so basically, um, 
did you, did you I can't really uh, see from here but did you get to the part where it's um, where he pushes a3 with yeah his we pawn. just retreat our, a3. Our, our, um, yeah okay and now you're saying that retreat. he can take that okay yeah, retreat. now yeah. we this is of course check yeah we're not gonna we're not gonna lose material but we're giving up the bishop that we um probably want to preserve for longer he's playing on whites Greg's trying to play on whites we need and we play on blocks but we need our black bishop too but but to I think this get is rid of the white bishop. If you do that, we got a good chance. All the bishops would be gone. I think we're happy. Okay. I think but we're happy. I have no, I have no we'll problem with this. I think this is basically. Yeah, I think correct. it'll be. I mean, I, I just, I just want to make sure that you guys are I okay understand. with losing the, or not losing, but yes. I'm losing, losing the bishop pair. Okay, I see. Okay. I see. Good, we're good, good, good bishops. No. <laughs> well, yeah, we're taking his. Uh, I think we're good gonna go. Bishop to our bad bishop. We're gonna go bishop to h3. All right, thank you. And hope Greg, we didn't make the a bishop in the wrong place. G2. Okay, this gets back here. And Greg's gonna try to castle, but and we. All right. We trade bishops. Okay, I'm happy with that. Okay, so go for it. h3. Bishop h3. Yeah. There we go. Now we've got that thing. Unless Craig has some other idea. Uh oh, what's he doing now? In there. Ta ta! What's it gonna be? Ambition to H3. Aha! I know sooner or later that it wasn't. Sooner or later you're gonna do that. 48. I guess they're going to have to think about this a little, Sam. Uh, that's a mistake, and that's a mistake. Hmm. Well, our friend Ben would say, this is a no-brainer. Before we take the bishop immediately, uh, shut up. It really isn't that necessary. I mean, we can, he, he, we have probably a move. He, he, he pushes the movie bishop back, we can take the rook. So it's very happy to take the bishop. I would rather castle. We can take the bishop, Oregon castle. We have an extra move. I say castle. Castle. Castle long? Or short. Castling short is probably safer. We can march. These these bishops are getting swapped next move, Dale. We don't have to worry about it. If we take it now, he'll take it with the king, okay? Yes. Or he'll move. He castled you know. king second. But he'll take it with the king, but get rid of that bishop. He's not That's going who wants, he's who, not going anywhere. He's not going anywhere. So if he, if he, if he moves the bishop it. here, we can take the rook. What do we do in terms of castling? Yeah. Who's for king side? Who's for queen side? Who's for an immediate capture of the bishop? Those are the three options, more or less. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I like the idea of castling king side. I do too. Yeah, yep. do too but don't I don't let like people it. talk you into. If somebody has. A, if we go to queen side, then then he 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 might be tempted to take this knight and straighten out our pawn. If we okay. castle, he might be... Well, his bishop um, takes takes knight. Is that an option on the table right now, or are we not looking at that? Because obviously there's no longer a pin, so that knight is now free to move. That's true. That's true. Where's he going to move? He move here? He move here. If we castle, let's assume we castle kingside. And he goes... Maybe you're right. Maybe we should take this knight first. I, th um, I think to, yeah, take the bishop first. The yeah, I actually, I actually agree with Dale 
because of the move, um, the, move can, the move A3. He um, can free his bishop, too. Because, okay, so say, well, let me think about this. We can always just take the bishop, and then we can make another decision. But I say we take the bishop. The, the bishop we to take him the is knight. almost like having another queen. Stop that it. White that doesn't say anything. I mean, you need to s say stuff. Um, I say if we castle kingside, he can do something like this. I mean, what's he have? We can move. Yeah. Yeah, I think um, I think just uh, a kingside castle is going to be going to be safe upon further calculation. Okay. If he does something like this. If we kingside castle, I think we almost say, okay, we didn't take that, but we have this. I should take the bishop. Stop it. Okay, Dale, we know how and then he does this. <laughs> he sort of has to, right? From that position. Yeah, I don't think he would expose himself to a pin like that. I don't need Although he gets like this well, idea. Yeah. I don't need it. I can see me doing it, but I don't see him doing it. Yeah, oh, I see me doing it intentionally. Um, we can. I don't see anything wrong with castling, taking the bishop next move. I'm a fan myself of taking the knight just because I know it's going to spring into action any moment, but that's just because I'm overly cautious. But, you know, castling is a solid move too, but for me, I'd probably take the knight for the bishop. But we know what the possibilities are, so. What now what we have to do? have to worry about is if we take the knight mm -hmm. and he does something like this, right? And I do something like this, and he does something like this. Okay. We're gonna have stop it. Take the and. Well then, I we'll think we win. I think he takes. We take. We win that exchange. We win the exchange. Right. Okay. I just had to see it. No, absolutely. Mm -hmm. absolutely. Okay. Okay, we take the knight or we castle. So what, what do you guys think over there? You said take, take the, knight. the knight. What do you think, Will? Castle? Um, I, mean, like, I think that we should castle. Um, I really want to connect rooks. Um, also, yeah, yeah. I just really want to connect to rooks for some reason, and I think um, I like the idea of connecting rooks too. That's not useless. If there's some complications that arise, um, so say he went, he went um, a three right, af right after we castled, we could take, um, yeah, we could take the knight on c three, um, and it, when his queen retook on b seven, or when his queen took on b seven, it um, just wouldn't be a big deal because we can go rook f to uh, b8 um, and we can gain a ton of uh, tempos on the queen and then um, later we can exchange uh, the light squared bishop off um, so yeah like I think I think castling is the safest move and it's gonna um, clear up some potential problems okay. in uh, okay. the future no, due to tactics no that's that's a good argument and mm -hmm. will's on fire lately he uh, just had a very I good know. performance <laughs> at the at the montana Open. Oh, okay so well, let's, let's hear if i calculated this correct <laughs> let's hear <laughs> uh, the weird thing is is we burn up far more time doing these unimportant things because i really don't think it matters what, how we play this i think okay. we're going to wind up in a similar situation so yeah. so <laughs> shall we go for the king size castle mm -hmm. okay all right great mm -hmm. okay there, we did it. Now what's going to happen on the side of the point? We've got... Kingside Castle. Kingside Castle. Okay.
still playing a bellious logical game. Good. Nothing flashy. Than we are, but no, yeah, but his is right. We've been leaving. So no. Brook A to C1. Which is it? Ooh. Yeah. Brook A to C1. Yeah, that's his thing. He's okay. anchor here, guys. Okay. Now I say we go ahead and do either, but basically I say take the bishop first. He'll have to retake it. If he plays games with this sort of thing, yeah. we can just mm -hmm. capture there and let him. Let him take this the, back. The knight, he's going to be hitting at C7. Is okay. So, so I'm happy I, to do this. This way we are sure that our queen will yeah. not be sucked off of there. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. Yeah, good. All right. Looks good. All right. I'll go tell him. That was quick and easy. Yeah. <laughs> and I know that. Oh, man. Dale's a lot happier now. He was worried about that vision. Yeah. Yeah, that's. <laughs> <laughs> How many times Bishop takes G2. Well, hang around. Oh, boy. <laughs> That's a no brainer. Yes. Right. So no, that's that's that King takes G2. Good. Yeah. Pretty much forced. Now, yes. anybody see a reason we should not continue with taking this knight? He's gonna, he's gonna go knight. He might, probably will go knight to. Um, he's gonna do this. He's gonna do this. To then he's gonna swipe and this. aim at C. He's gonna be aiming at C um, seven. He's gonna be aimed at C seven. Right. And also, he might take the B one too. Mm -hmm. So you might consider okay. moving. Going to B6, you might consider that to shore up our ponds over there. Okay, I was then, thinking of all this mess. And I say we do this, he's going to take, I think, with the rook. That there, he is threatening this one. Yeah, and we go C7. pawn up, and I think we can look at this. And this, he's not going to want to do. So I think, um, I think that our D5 squares super weak. Because um, only our queen is controlling it, and his c3 knight and b3 queen yeah. okay. are controlling it. So you might I'm, want to I'm wondering tonight. if um, some sort of a rook move would be better to um, control that square. And then if he does kick our bishop, we can decide if we want to take um, the knight, or if we want to um, back him off and then um, kick the queen off of um, b7 with a rook. Okay, I just, I, I hear what you're saying. We don't need to move the queen. I know we don't need to, but let's look at this for a second. Okay. Oh, that, yeah. That would be a trade. That would be a good idea, maybe. How does he stop that? That would be a good idea if it worked. I kind of like that. So I think, um, I think what he'll do then. Yeah, so except he could put his knight six. on. On D four, yeah, and then um, and then, uh, knight no. on what? I don't think he can. Well, knight on D four is that what you said, Dale? Yeah, he it's good. D not that D5, one. D five actually. The other one. Are you? No, D Dale said D four. He could do that. Put it on D four and see what happens. Mm -hmm. Okay, the queen's in danger. Okay, we swap queens. Sick. And that we do first. And then, then if he takes our knight, we're we're going to be on uh, stack bonds over on the queen side. And that no, we don't do that. We just do this. We just do bishop takes here, and then and lose our queen. No, we oh, take you mean it back. Swap queens, oh, please. I see. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I see what you're saying. You're right. I mean that. You're right. Okay, we go. We don't want stack pawns over there on the 
we we got to protect our ponds on the Queen site for real. Okay, if that if he does that, we we have to take Queen down here, and he's got double ponds. Kind no, of he doesn't. He takes he takes with the knight. I kind of don't think he'll do that. But he takes with the knight, and then we continue. So that's not actually that bad a move. But it's a trap. I mean. So what about what about the but, move? Um, we go queen six, like you said, but then he goes knight d five. Knight d five. Yeah. He's hitting on that C, on the pawn of C. Yeah, so he hit, so basically he'll C7. hit C7. We gotta defend that somehow. Because um, that's what this opening is. He opens up the C file. Or okay, if he does this, this is all all right. I think we just move back here, which is where I felt we should have gone earlier. Oh, the rook might take it. Oh, well, see. yeah, then we would loop up. But also the knight takes the pawn. C7. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah back D6. there. D6. That D6 might, will be... Um, that might work. Desirable. No, then he takes the B pawn. Pawn with the thing there, yes. That's true. Um, the see. best might be just do simple. We will we will get his B2 pawn at the end of that sequence if he does you, take our B7. Yeah, this thing here. Oh, heavens. Yeah, he won't lose that if he can help it. The... Oh, he might though because the rocks. I guess this is not a good, a good a move. I don't it's think we ought to move our queen anymore. Too complex. Where did this thing come from? It's on C3. Um, I think we just plain take the knight. Okay. Yeah, I think. <laughs> I think that after, after all that, yeah, keeping okay. it simple is probably it's the best. Within reason. This is, uh, yeah. I think it's we could do it if we had more time. Because we'll probably yeah. lose the bishop anyway. Okay, are we into doing it? Okay, okay. yeah. Takes knight. Yeah. All right, I'll tell him to move and I'll try to sink the uh, box. Okay, so good. And we got no bishops to worry about losing. <laughs> Is anybody keeping score on it? Okay, I have a move. Bishop takes knight. Oh, mm. that's too bad. Okay. I have plans for that knight. And is your clock accurate, by the way? I think so. Okay. Wow, we're really out of sync. But, uh... Yeah. Well, I'll that usually happens. How, many, how much time do you have? How much time do you think you I t taken? Uh, it looks like you've taken about 40 minutes on here. Wait I now. took 40 minutes? Wait, no. No. 35, I yeah. I'll how can I take 30, How can I take 35? I don't know because um, they haven't been hitting the clock in there, so it's gotten way out of whack. Oh it's yeah. It's okay. I'll go ahead and fix it. Well, oh, too bad. You took my knight. Okay, so your time is well, at about 11, 12 minutes. I used 12 minutes and I used, but now one three. It's not. I'm not terribly surprised that this happened. That this usually happens. Rook takes bishop. Rook takes bishop. It, that's it. That's you know what I'm saying. So we gotta watch for trap. Okay. But you're right. Uh, uh, the I move is rook takes bishop. Yeah. Rook okay. Takes bishop. This is what Let's I was get expecting. these protected. And uh, okay. let me just step over here to sink this clock. Yeah, we well. are way way off. I forgot. That's I okay. And it was largely my fault. The clocks are so messed up. Okay. We're that's right. That's correct. That's us. <coughs> okay. Go ahead, sir. Do you want me to help? Or I mean, all of you. You guys, Greg. You know, Greg has almost an hour, and we've got. Ben's right. We got about forty-eight minutes. Okay. Forty-seven and a half. Minutes. All right. If, right. If we go here, and yeah. he goes here. Oh, well, that's bad. Then going here won't he'll, help. He'll bring his it. other rook over, I think. 
I don't think he'll put the queen there. I think the rook will be what does it. The, well, the other, the F yes, to I C, see that. Maybe. Here. Um, I think we have to figure out how to do this. It's going to be off. Yeah, of yeah. This. Yeah. Immediately. Yeah. Yeah, we got to do it fast. If he moves his rook over, we can't even do that. It won't work. That that's. Anyway, that's what Denzi says about why this opening. Nobody's ever been in this position before. Pardon me? <laughs> um, yeah, this is normal. It's not, except for all this. <laughs> if this was here, it'd be normal. I didn't mind, uh, I don't know. You guys know. Okay. Let's. Um, we got to defend this somehow. C7. That's going to be our hard, hard one to defend. Well, we can do this. And. Um, here's another. Well, you're right about taking this pawn, but here's an idea. What? Maybe there. To get him out of there. See, right. that protects everything. And our knight won't be over on the rim where it can't do nothing. So that is well, a possibility. It, it, do we have to worry about his taking that pawn immediately? Huh, I don't know. No, the rook over. See, that's a more powerful move. Hmm. The, the, how about guys? If how we about have the knight, one? if the knight's here, yeah, then it's in the center, and it's going to get rid of his other knight. I think our I think uh, our main problem yeah. right now is B seven. Then we, okay, he goes there and then we move F to B. And then we take his pawn. Gender, if he takes that, we move our F rook over to the B. And then he's uh, got to get his queen out of there. And okay, then we take his here. pawn and then we, we straighten our rooks. You know, okay. We, then we That's not crazy. So he's got two pieces on this. Well, that could happen, yeah. That will happen. Okay, then just take his queen. And then take... He's got a queen on the seventh. I mean, you could get his knight, seventh. too. And, but that's that's kind of the way maybe to do it, to keep from... If we, if we put the knight on the rim, it's going to purr. It depends what he does. If he does this, we're in... We're, you know, we're doing I'm good. I'm your board. Just to get a clearer idea of what's happening here. We're actually doing I don't good. feel like losing all these pawns. Uh, no, don't. Don't lose any of them. None of them. Yeah, I guess do, this is... This the is, night, this is the night for right now. is going to yeah. cause him to have to do something. Here, the the right night. Let's go back and then we take right here. And then that's, that's, that's really good Cause, for us. Because, look, if you put the knight there, if he don't take our but knight... This is going to get super weak. Then and we take his knight. He'll have to take it with the king, and our queen can get no. right behind him, right what behind his right? king. What about is it our move, move in this position? Huh? Is it our move in this position? Yeah. yeah. Okay. So I think what's going to happen is we go here, and then he doubles. But, but the knight on the rim. Yeah, like that, I wouldn't do it. Okay. I'd move the knight yeah, to here, yeah. and that might be a really good move. So I think that it might so be. Like if we just look, look at this, this. Go for then, then move knight that rook this. over. Rook double c6. He, he might take it with the rook, though. That would be even worse. No, then you take his queen. So we can push this pawn okay. eventually. Okay. So you're moving the knight immediately. Is well, this? Uh, I think yeah, what if he took it with the rook, though? Then you just take What he was saying, because, yeah, like, I don't see how else we can defend... Um, C7 right. without having a super super cramped position. I mean maybe um, maybe and then when we do push C6 we fit C7. Here. Okay. So but maybe, he's got he's got a move. Maybe, it's not our move. I think he, I think he Is it? Okay. So so you and Dale agree? I I do actually um, agree with Dale's move. Um, this is actually pretty good for us. We can do this. This pawn gets scary as past. But remember our knight. Our knight's in a heck of a good place, and if it's over on the rim, it's not. Mm -hmm. 
Night on the rim is grim. <laughs> yep. Sometimes. <laughs> Words of wisdom. Generalities of whatever. And anyway, I'm happy to do that. This is an all right move. Yeah, I think it's, I think it's really good. Okay. okay, you want to do that? Okay. But whose move is it though, Greg's? Oh, yeah. it's ours. What did we do? Go here. 95. 95, really? Yeah, let me make sure that's... What are you feeling? Yes. Give me that B2 pawn, huh? You can try and take it if you want. I'm trying to hold this in front of the camera. This is the whole point of the whole program. Make sure the camera sees this, okay? So then people out, people out there know what to send back. If they're curious what World we'll Chess is, so they, they know how to contact somebody, okay? Mm -hmm. Hold that in front of the camera for a long while. Oh, I'll, so give you, um, I'll give you, I'll give you, I'll right. give you seven. Um, you two. <laughs> okay, get him back. Where did Greg? He hasn't, must hasn't moved yet, probably. Oh, this is Nancy. Does anybody know what time it is? It's a, almost 7 30. Okay, I got time. We're doing good, guys. I'm still thinking in there. Yeah, that, yeah, I know. There's a good move. See, Will shouldn't have talked about it. He don't want to take it because, see, <laughs> yeah. now, we've, now all of a sudden we've <laughs> got more. I, I think Will might have blown the game for us. And, and, and then we got this. What are we going to do? I wonder how we could get the will to watch that. And then it, 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 it straightens out our disaster ponds over there. <laughs> but he's gonna. Okay. Let's see. I bet he won't take it with the knight. He might move the knight back here. He might. Or maybe there. No. We'll go there. Well, he might just double the rooks. Well, this is awesome. Yeah, I know that's a good move, but but see this. Right. I mean that could happen, and then if he, and then if these are gone, he's got that. I don't. We'll find out. That's a good move. Maybe if he took this line to move, it is a good move. And did you hear what he said? <laughs> and this could be a poison pawn. I hope. I hope. But see, there's the next move, like Paul wanted to do in the first place. Remember a long time ago? I think it was a good idea, Dale, getting that knight out of there. We gotta start those pawns. Instead of here, then he's got another move plus. You know what I mean? What? And then, I mean anything is there. Okay. So what knight takes e5. Whoa! Whoa! Yeah! Well, this seems to be straight. simplifying our game for us. Yay! Uh, we all know what we have to do, right? We have to take, take the knight back the to the yeah. And yeah. I'm glad we're not getting any argument over that one. Hooray! Um, yeah. So pawn takes knight. Yeah, okay, takes now, knight. now the scary part. If he does this, we're going to have a vote. Yeah, oh my gosh. Okay. He's going to take b7 with his queen. Um, and that's yeah, he might do this, so he might do go. this. And yeah, if he, he does, do I wonder what the move is. <laughs> All righty. So if yeah, we try C7's his, the weak spot on this. Yeah, if we try and kick his queen, um, okay, so let's say queen takes uh, B7. Right. Um, if we went rook F to B8, he's just going to take on C7. Yeah, that's cool. Then queen. we just take, yes. Yeah, but if he does that, queen takes and rook And he gets takes. two pawns. Yeah, and, and then we come pawn. down and take his but other But we're on pawn. the 7th rank, and we're threatening pawns on both sides. On the, We're threatening pawns on A2 and E2 at that point. That might okay. I, mean, I don't know if that's worth it, but it's something. Yeah, it's uh, he's got only two pawns here, and if we take I that, I think this pawn, is what he's going to do. Yeah, I think he'll, I think he'll do it's that. It's probably too. good enough for a draw, at least. 
Yeah, we might get a well, draw. Let's, let's see what he does, and yeah. then we'll take a quick look at it. We can both just hang He does out. have an upon majority. <laughs> you can hang on his seventh rank. And he does this. Oh, shit. All we need when to do is get him, him there, and we yeah. got, we, we're good. If this we is all fairly self ordered Now, I don't like his rook on the seventh rank, but I think we're okay. But ours gets there, too. Ours gets there, too. And we yeah, as long as the pawn. other one don't get and there. And we're forking the pawns on either side. Yeah, then we got yeah. look at that other pawn. You see the E pawn. And the and the one pawn. We got another one. Yeah. We could get a pass we're pawn. We're we can get a pass pawn on uh, a seven here if we take. And the, the point pawn. is, mm -hmm. he didn't get a pass pawn. I'm not sure we're, we're going to be able to get a pass pawn. Yeah, he probably would try. push the a pawn to stop that. But at least then we can capture the e pawn, and then that d three pawn is sitting there all by itself. But don't you think this is good though? I mean, yeah. To yeah, we're going to be we're going to be completely fine. I thought that yeah. we were just lost. When I no, if he goes here, no, we didn't just lose. We, um, not with Greg though. You yeah. never, ben, you never you know. You never know. You never yeah, know. I feel he's like very uh, there's there's a number on that on that piece of paper. We're really good players, so you yeah, I'm going to show you. Yeah, you take over. Ben Slaughter the last time we played a tournament. We know how to do everything. Rook to c5. Rook to c5. Okay. So, um, hey, Will, how was this? How was this just a moment ago? This is part of our analysis, but this what isn't. What exactly? Here, it's like this. It's not like that at all. Okay. Um, you got to set it up. It's not. Yeah. So, our, yeah. which position did, the queen, position did you want to get back to? I wanted to get back to where we are. Okay. Here, so we're at three a queen on b three. Okay. Yeah. And then there's also um, a b two pawn. Okay. Where's our queen? It's, is it over there? Probably. Oh, yeah. It's supposed to hold that up because okay. otherwise it's the point of the program. I give it to Will, it's supposed to hold it up. Oh, I see. Nope, I need the number. I need the number, sorry. Down there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. It's supposed to hold up the number with a t TV camera. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> sorry about that. C5? The rookies, yes. Queen is on D7, I believe. Okay. No, it's not. The rook isn't there. Where is, okay. The rook goes on C. Okay, yeah. Yes. Yes. He just C3. And, then, C3. Yeah, and right yeah. below that queen is a pawn. Right. And there's a pawn on C2. Okay, and sorry. We're just resetting up the position and, because it got distorted. I mean A2 and B2. There's pawns. Right there. Okay. Okay, our queen is on D7. There we go. We got okay, it. Okay, so what he just did. I'm sorry, what was to C5. Rook to C5. Okay. So that's he where moved, he just whoa, went. Whoa. So he's. Okay, he's taking advantage of the fact that. Oh, he I, he's this. splitting them. Uh, I know what. I got it. What do you, I know. I know. Here you I go, know. Paul. Did he play? No, he. Okay. Right. Now, I don't know if we're in trouble or not. I haven't looked at it. This is going to be hard. But. Um, he wants. Uh, oh, shoot. Greg's. So uh, I think, I think we need to hit the clock again. So, yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, we lost. We're okay. Time is wrong. Okay, I think we just do this, right? No, yep. no, 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 no. Because you need no. that for the B8. You need that for the B8 when he takes that pawn. Yeah, but you might have well, to move it again. Yeah, but if he does yeah, this. Then, then well. you see, now that rook's got to go over to B8. Yeah. Okay, then, and then, okay, it does. then the queen can move. The queen can move to either D D five or it can move to um it can move to E four. I wouldn't put the rook to defend that pawn. Mm -hmm. Cause you um, need that rook over there when he takes that pawn. Okay, so we used we defend it with the queen. Because that's it. It's all we have to defend it with. You can Okay. There's a huge yeah. problem on B7 right now. So what do you recommend, Dale? Well, okay, this is this could happen. Hey, no, really. Move the move to C6. He takes. He takes. Um, try that. Okay, Rook takes pawn. Okay, F Rook goes to um, E E8. Put the F Rook on E8. Okay. You see? You see the pawn on E2 and plus the rook, it's going to be another rook trade. So we're going to be that much closer. We're going to have good pawn structure on the Okay, side. this is what's going to happen. Um, I don't know what's going to happen. He's going to take 
Thank you. Uh, he's going to take uh, this takes. He has to go like this. Well, and that's what yeah, but he might like. defend it too. Look at look at the other alternative on that. Put the rooks back. He might defend. He might not just take it. He usually don't. Mm. Okay, the rooks there and that rooks there now, and the pawns are safe on the queen side. He can't. He can't get the pawns. Yeah, he definitely won't. So you prefer yeah. that, Dale, because uh, we lose the pawns the rook, in the exchange. You lose the pawn, yeah. We're going to have to give up a pawn for something. Like, you give up a, a gambit. Hmm. I actually don't Take. think we, we uh, need to lose e5. I think uh, Paul's suggestion at the beginning um, solves, solves our problems, because basically rook to e8, um, rook f to e8. If his no, queen no, takes, yeah. let him let him finish. If his queen takes on b7, then we actually move rook e to yeah. b7. And then he's got the he's got a7. We're we're not going to have no pawns left over there, and he's going um, to. He won't. Yeah, he will not have a7 because that's defended by the a8 rook. No, if you move it, what, okay, do it, do it, Paul. What he said. So basically, uh, what Will is recommending. Here, put him back like this. Will is recommending your move, Paul. Yeah, your I think move. your move. move. Yeah, so yes. that move, and so the pawn is back. Put the Our pawn, pawn back. back on C7. Put the pawn back. So if no, no not no, that, that one. This pawn. Yeah, yeah, that one. Yeah. So okay, no, okay, he does that, and then Queen takes B B B7. Now Queen what? takes. Now this queen is takes really B7. important. Rook E to B8. Rook E to B8. Yeah, and this like well, that's what Paul did in the first place. Right. Yep. Okay, queen yeah. takes takes queen, that. Queen takes. Or this is what we analyzed previously. Yes. Yeah. This yeah. is how we save the pawn. Then queen takes queen. queen rook takes queen. queen. Rook takes queen. Yeah, and then rook takes. And pawn. then our rook comes down, takes pawn on b two. Yeah, that it. That'll yeah. be pretty even. Should I tell? Yeah. That yep. might work. Yeah. You want to do that then instead? Yeah. Okay. Your move, Paul. You got it. This one. Mm -hmm. Here it is. So rook F to E8. Now what's he gonna do? Are they are they holding up the sign for TV? Yeah, he might yeah, go yeah here. we got it. I'll um. I'll okay, good. As well. Okay, that that's, that's the whole point of this whole program. Is people out there get to know how to contact people for chess. Mm -hmm. Rook F to E8. Oh, all right, another logical move. Boink. We're not this is a good game. It's gotten, into <laughs> okay. a, it's gotten into a really good game. Offering me that B pawn. They keep on offering me that B2 pawn like a big juicy uh, cherry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it kind of, it seems like, uh, it seems like you might be able to draw with us if you take that. <laughs> Just mess around. I know, I'm kidding you. But I think that uh, chances of a draw are pretty pretty good if you do take that. No. Proper queen trade, hmm? Yeah. <coughs> so queen to. Oh no, he could do this. We didn't even queen think to of D5. that. Queen to e5. Queen to e5. D5. Where's d5? Uh oh. This is it, guys. Proper queen trade. d5. Yeah. Now we got some good stuff going on here. Well, that's I, ex I expected this. No, so I didn't this. expect it. <laughs> no, I think this is good. He's showing I think concern. It's fine. I think this is so easy. I think it's a no-brainer, yeah. right? Take queen, queen takes queen. Queen takes queen? Yes. I think that we should probably aim for a draw. 
Okay. Oh, absolutely. It just seems like <laughs> if we can draw them, that'd be wonderful. Because yeah. I, yeah. I don't, I don't Jack. think we have enough time. To, yeah. Um, do it. Do calculate, it. calculate a win. Yeah. Okay. Go I'm get sorry. it, guys. I'm sorry. Uh, am I going? Or okay, you're going. No, uh, we got okay. an opportunity to win over here. Okay. Well, well if it happens, great. But the yeah. meantime, let's we'll swap queens. I agree. Because no. Yeah. I So queen takes d5. Let's say I wonder what I, I wonder what I should reply. This is a tough move. <laughs> yeah, it is. <laughs> I still like this. We got. But I also like this. Wait a minute. Hold it. We, we got this. We could do this and this. Huh? What? We could do these. We got to think of how to get down and win. Well, this is a weak spot. We could do that, but yeah, then he's going to come. Yeah. But, if, but what if we did this and this? Okay. It's well, a trade well, off. Like saying we have, uh, I don't know what you hear. We got a so chance to win this is our on the weakness. queen side. Since the queens well, are out, I don't think like he F6 has a good square for this. No if he goes no here, um, I think we're very happy. What if we look? He's got. Hey, that's like true. Can no, no, he can go here. Let's trade the rook. Yeah, Paul. Paul. He can go here. Okay. Yeah, I know that. That's the that's the concern. The seventh rank. Let's go here. Let's go here. Uh, Dale, one thing at a time, please. Um, yeah. Trade the rooks. Get rid of the rook. So right now we're concerned about him going to the seventh rank. Dale is suggesting rook to d8. To trade rooks. Greg's real good with two rooks. Yeah, wait. Really good. Um, the and they're not, his too. aren't connected. Okay. Let's. Um, I am. I think D Dale's got a good. Point. I think forget the pawns. I. He I goes don't. Here, he goes yeah. Here. Don't let that happen. Okay, we got it. Um, well, I don't think this is that bad. Because oh yeah, it's not bad, but don't let it happen. Because have. you can, he's he can't back this rook up. Let's trade it. And and you can do this. Yeah. And then you do this. You get him off the seventh rank, or he just yeah. But we can trade it seven. real easy here. We can trade it now, and then if he goes over here, we can move our pawns and push it back. Well, he's going to stay in the open file. Oh. There. Okay, now we can go back. But at least we're advancing the pawns that way. We yeah, I, I mean, I, I prefer this. I think it works perfectly. I think you just go position, here. position wise. Here rooks. you let him, you let him, come down here, which, I mean, there's a lot of moves. But you, you let him come down there. It looks bad. You go here rather than here because this is just too. Yeah, messy. Right. I agree with that. But but rooks in the center are good. Yeah. True, but there, then but from here, is in the center and ours you isn't. do this. He does probably his rooks are nicely separated. He goes over here, something like that. He just isn't doesn't have anything you can do. You go here and here, and I why think not just trade it in the first place? It'd well, I don't think it forces a trade. What? Doesn't I don't think it forces a trade. It don't, but our rooks are in the center and his No, aren't. he's got a point. It doesn't force a trade, but it does get our rook onto an open our file. Our rooks are on the center. And it allows us to start marching our pawns rapidly okay. rather than chasing yeah. his rook around. Okay, we'll do it this way. we got a heck of a okay. lot better chance yeah. out. I way. think that saves a lot of tempo. Okay. And it saves so many moves in time. Okay, but he okay. can't do anything with his moves either. That was my feeling. Okay, okay. so okay, I'll go ahead and tell him. So he we're might, doing he'll rook probably A take, to D8. Yeah, yeah. he'll probably okay. take our rook. Well, actually, hold up. Hold up for a second. Oh, it's okay. We, um, okay, the rook, sorry. I had everything backwards. I thought that we were going to lose c7. I'm crazy. I'm sorry. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> no, c7. Yeah, yeah it's, I have it's not been talking to this mic. I really hate it. look like on the thing, but, um. Okay, Greg, our move is rook a to d8. Rook a. C7, sorry. Yeah, just. Okay, Wilk. Yeah, that's right. You got to make your move. Well, I don't have to make the move right now, but I'll wait for it. My move is broke to his work. Okay. Okay, good. We're take truck, right? Yes. All right. 
Everybody agree? Yeah, Rook has to take Rook. We go okay. Rook Rook. Okay, now it's an end game with the pawns. He's probably going to... Rook takes Rook. And a surprise move. <laughs> I, I took it that way because I it gets it gets into a uh, more of an elementary in game. Mm -hmm. okay. so just a little, right. and we Rook can see one. Yeah, I knew that. Okay, now we got to defend this guy, and um, we move it to there. So C6, okay. does that seem to make sense? Uh, yes, uh, you know, you can play with game works moves like this, but I don't see any reason to. I think that. Yeah. Okay. All right, my guess is he's going to advance the rook and maybe start harassing the pawns. He's good. Yeah, right, he could not go there. About that. That's okay. okay. Well, if he does this, we got pawns, I think man. we do this. That's a good one, too. No, that'll put it for a draw. That's fine. What's the magic number for the restroom? Always. There, just can in the paper. Well, I think this moves our best, and that would make a draw if he takes it. That would make a draw. Okay. I mean, it's it's a common sense. I'm, I'm good for it too. So as soon as Greg is back, I'll let him know. C6. That looks good. This is our move. Yeah. Uh, as far as I'm concerned, this is, should be on Greg's clock. C6. <laughs> yeah. Absolutely. I'm not yeah. joking. I mean, that's correct. That's you know, I'm that's not. True. I'm not being yeah. a cheat. Um, Did somebody tell the move to? Yeah, but this should be on Greg's clock. Yeah, so make sure C6. our button's pushed and his is running. And that's fairly standard for tournament play. If yeah. you can get up and do something, the clock keeps running. Yeah. Okay. Now we now we can do fonts. We know how. Oh my god. This game has been awesome. Okay. Rook and pawn end game. So I guess what do we um, yeah. want to do about the E5? Okay, Sam, what's the move? Oh, well, not a logical move. To a very logical game. You close that door, okay? But, uh, you see anyone hold up that my sign yet? Have they hold up my sign yet? Yeah. I hope they tell them to hold up my sign. That's the whole idea, okay? Okay. Make sure they hold up my big sign, okay? Yep. Then you want the, the post office by the sign? Yeah. Because that's, that's the whole purpose of the whole thing is... To hold up the sign. People have to know out there what to send in for comments or anything about the program. So make sure right. they... Uh, I'll go to Algo Tom right now. Yeah, I've been yeah. keeping... Uh, make sure you see them hold it up there for long enough, okay? Yep. Okay. But he can. Don't move our rook no more. Leave our there's, rook. there's advantages to here too. If we get our. Okay. okay. There's this. Hold up that sign for this camera. A request. If we move our rook out, he'll develop off of it and we'll lose it Are they eventually. That? See. I'm not sure if I need to be more central to us. You're good. I can see you on the monitor. Bring it this way. 
Okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah, 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 I'm not sure. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay. What do we give him, a, give him a close up? There we go. Ooh. We could move the king king over right now. Yeah. We could. You mean king to east seven? Yeah, do we have the opposition? He's going to try to get opposition. Okay. Opposition has to be the same color square. I don't think we need to do that yet. There are too many, yeah, there are too many pawn moves need to be you waiting. Might wanna, I, I think we either do that. That's kind of scary, but it might work. Or we do something. I honestly think we can no, do this. No, no, no. Why not? Because he can, okay, he gets a free move right there. What are we going to do with the rook? With what? With this. What, what, with what? this, we take his pawn. Oh. I, I'd say like to that. keep our rook. He doesn't like that. I promise you, he's not going to do that. Yeah, no, you're right. I think about that, that. Um, so, Paul, are you saying go rook d4? I'm saying there there are real advantages to it. We should look at. No, I think that it's uh it's the only like a really active move that we have. Yeah, except we can be defensive or we can activate the rook. Um, and then try and um, attack his queenside pawns. And our, oh, wait a minute. Uh, well, if we put the rook there, he, he goes yeah, there. Go. Then we advance. And then if we seven. take his rook, he goes there and it's a draw. Maybe you're right, Paul. I don't know. There we go. I mean, it could be. But, but I think we ought to get our king out here. I really do. Okay. Well, it's not going to happen that quickly. Um, yeah. I think this is not a bad move at the moment. You know, it's nothing to panic over. I think you wait, wait see a minute, our king up. isn't there. Our king's here. Okay, our king's here. But we could do this and then pull our king out. We There's a reason we don't analyze on that board because it's going to wind yeah. up looking like this board. Um, but okay, so you we need our king out because this king will get in the center. Okay. Well, if we're, go if we're big on getting the king out, then I'm for you and your move here. Yeah, that's a Or even here. But yeah. he Is this how we are? Because this lets us go here and here, which well, is a lot faster than one, you, two, three, yeah. four. If you move it out too, it stops his king from going anywhere. That's true. On the other hand, but we he can, can, if he goes yeah. here. We go here. It looks like stupid, but then we come down here That's with, true, with but he's, he can do other things like you know. Yeah, I know, I know. So I, I am a little concerned that his king is getting centralized. Yeah, very let's quickly get our ours king out. Okay, well this so one of the that reasons I like this. That's this is this is not a bad move to stop his king from getting centralized. It's not a bad move for the rook. Yeah, our, then if he takes our rook, his king's out there, and our king isn't. His king will wipe our pawns. Okay, out. so what's the threat to our rook, Dale? His, going his to king is not going to wipe our pawns out because they're all defended, and this one becomes defended like that. In other words, there's really no problem. His king can't do a whole lot at the moment. I think we should just. I think this is, the, you know, a relatively exciting position and move. I think. Is exciting? Yeah. So I looked at. I looked at. I looked at one line of that, and um, so we go rook d4. He goes rook c4. Um, and then we take, um, pretty much we have to take or retreat. If we do take, then, then, it's um, a drop then his what he has in. is he actually has better king yeah, activity he's got than we better do. Than we right. and, uh, when we're just like, say we um, either move here or go F6, yeah, he's going to he's gonna come up here. His and he's going to have the more centralized, king flexible this. king like I don't, like I don't think it's a win, and maybe if he does, I, I think it's a straight draw. draw. I think that's, it's a straight that's really kind a draw of a win. Yeah, because I think there's a draw there's because there's nothing win. he can do. Because I mean, here we've got here and so on, so yeah, forth. Yeah, we've got ideas like push this up. Yeah, and well, obviously, and we can first. we get that there, and you know, it's just it's going to be a very yeah. equal mess. And if he wants to, if he wants to draw his white, that's uh, fine yeah. with us. <laughs> what if he moves to C3 and then he pushes the pawn? Should I go report this move? I leave you the mic. I, I, wouldn't, I, do, I wouldn't do that room. I'd get that king out. We're going to be better to put okay. okay, we need a move. Everybody's going to be I happy. I think we have a, a consensus for the most part. I What's think that? we agree that the, I mean, we have a, a dissenter, but yeah, for the most part, yeah, let's do the rook move. And we're running low on time. We're so moving. We yeah. Yeah. Work move? Okay. Yes. Okay. Oh, yeah. What I'd do if I was Greg is go there. Here you go, Will. Okay. And then I got all this. And this here isn't here to protect anything. I think. Yeah, our rook can always um, retreat as well. 
Okay, there's a lot of excitement here right now. We're approaching the final stages of the game, and what's happening right now is we're trying to stop his king, Greg's king, from getting centralized. So the rook move down here prevents the king from getting to the center of the board. And at some point, we're also going to have to get our king mobilized and get towards the center of the board as well, which is a very drawish type of position because both sides have the same amount of material and just one rook apiece. He can go here and if we exchange those rooks off, it's pretty much over in terms of nobody being able to win. Thank you very much. <laughs> I don't think he'll, he, I don't know what he'll do, but he can go here, that's what I do. King to E3. Mm -hmm. That's what I has moved King to E3. All right. That's what I thought. We're I'm in trouble now. I saw him read the button. Okay. Here's, here's what can happen now. He can go from tab to uh, four and break out, and then we can't take it because our rooks are. Uh, Right. So I think so. F six looks okay. Yeah. Then what? Okay. He's gonna go here. F six. F six looks good to me. That's too. even worse. Look. Why is it worse? Cause look. What are you gonna do? Okay. There. And then he goes here. What are you gonna do? F six. Well, Six. okay, you did that. Then no. he does this. Six. Excuse me. Oh. Oh, man. <laughs> See, like I was looking at the um the pawn move F four after we go um F six. Okay, what you, what happens if he does that? And that kind of uh let's see here. Yeah, it could, it could leave us with an isolated pawn. You know, it's back up. And, you know, what we can do is this. Well, how about we drop no, the rook? We're going to lose our... Failed, you don't put failed, rooks failed, failed. Calm down. Uh, how about if we do rook to d5 at that point? At this point? If we, if, if, yeah, right. At this point, if we fall back one square, rook to d5. That would If be he good. takes the pawn, you yeah. take back with the rook check. That's good, that's good, that's good. Okay. That, right, that was sort of the original idea. So no, this is we're going to do this and trade. <laughs> but he might not do this F1. But no, he might not do F4. It's just yeah. a contingency. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I think we're in good shape. Okay. Yeah, I like, uh, I like rook D5 if he does go F4. He might do this, too. Come over here. Maybe, but I doubt it. But maybe. This is cool. So what do we do? Move here? F6? If he does this. Yeah, I mean, well. It's our move, isn't it? So yeah, I, I like this. Okay, that's a good one. Or do you want to go, if we do all of this? And no, that's we, bad, that's bad. Okay, and then he does this, Yeah. and then you do this. How was that bad? Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's good. Okay, that's good, too. Scary, but good. Yes, Wait, yes, are you guys talking about F5? Correct. Uh, well, he's talking about F5, yeah. F5. F5 okay. could we've work. got to we've got to move faster. So how are we going to do that? Um, I think um, F4 will be really powerful there. From so here, here really powerful. Yeah, like I think um, if if F5 he goes he, F4. He's got a way to stop it though. No okay. wait. Well, look. Okay, watch, time. watch. 
He goes no, here. No, we go here, and then he goes here. Now we're now we're in more trouble. Because Greg loves these kind of, you know, presents. I, I don't care about Greg loves. I just care about the Yeah, position. but look, what are we going to do now? We're going to be in Zugzwag eventually. See what I mean if this happens? That's worse. Well, you just... Uh, you I hate this board being used as for... Oh, okay. Yeah, Dale, so. can you call out the moves? Yeah. yeah. Instead of using that board? Yeah, okay. So... Um, Okay, basically. So either F6 or F5, but... I, I like F6. Everybody else like Will likes F6. I think F6. it's I think it's I think it's a safer move. It's safer. Okay, because yeah. we have to we have to run. That's our okay. problem. Okay, we do it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. And we do have less time than that clock is showing. I think that clock is probably five minutes behind yeah. the one Greg is using. So we have less than half an hour to go. Okay, here we are. We are going F6. Six. Have you held up the sign yet? That big sign? Oh, I'll take a look. Oh, I think make sure I they think it is. hold I think that in. Because otherwise, it defeats the point of. Um, in my own opinion, because I do it on the computer all the time. If if we don't, because we got the palm majority, but the kings. Anyway, okay, don't happened? touch. But the we sport. got a chance to win. Yeah. Okay, what's what doing there? Where did you do? You did what you said you do. Okay. You did it. Has Greg moved? Yeah. Or is he yes. still? Yeah. He moved. Okay, there it is. F four. Okay. okay. Now we retreat the rook, right? Right. Okay. Yeah, Dale, why don't you call out the moves? Let's not use that. Well, th this time, yes, because it's, well, it's oh, I'm, so, oh, I'm sorry, we okay. haven't moved yet. And we retreat the rook, that was the plan. I mean, yeah. look at it. It's yeah. He goes here, we go here. Yeah. All right, so are you guys okay with the move we talked yeah, about? Now, that, that, now we're do that's good, I'd say. Right, that was the one I... Well, you figured that out. Okay. No, now, is he going to do this? <laughs> Very likely. It don't matter. Then we just take the pawn. We're going to have to. Or maybe we Take don't. This maybe we don't. Maybe we don't. Okay. Could check him again. Is he, is, is he <laughs> I can't believe you're drinking coffee this hour. That's crazy. Uh,
trouble. I knew it. Remember? Which I expected. Remember that. Okay. I think it's okay. That's okay. what he I wants. don't think we're playing it. I think I, don't mind move, that I think it's time to move the king here. Um, we're, we're or that's exactly what Greg wants. And then he can bind us up. Those pawns are getting locked up on that side. That's though. what he wants. Well, right, so that's I have fine. a uh, position. I have a couple ideas. We can either go king f7, or we could go rook back to d4. I got an idea. How about this? Can you say the move, Dale? Oh uh, yeah. How about um? How about g g5? <coughs> and then he won't impose on it. I bet you anything, because he'll screw his pawn structure. G but bring the king out, I guess. G here. Well, you, no, he's saying our pawn, black, our pawn to G5. Black, black pawn to G5. Yeah. I think it's far more important to get our king mobilized myself. Well, I do, too. Yeah, I, yeah, I do, too. I, I think we move there. Yeah. All right, should I tell him? Yeah. What king dance in? Okay. Here we go, guys. I'm coming after him. I figured he might. King F7. Oh, honey. C4. C4. Okay, here we go. Okay. He did it now. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Now I'm trying to think about... Maybe we'll see better. Okay. okay. Very smart I'm thinking of... Um, unless there's an immediate threat for the rook. The rook might be aiming for G4 to prevent what? the king from moving this forward. For he can't mm -hmm. be here. If I we mean, move the king, his rook might yeah, be G4. Can. What are you going to do? Yeah. This is our... We just, you guys are just swapping positions, oh. right? Yeah. I don't okay. know. Don't worry about what we're going from the camera's path. Okay. Again, we have to move fast. I think we have two yeah. yes. left. Okay. I think his rook is aiming for G4. Well, this rook can get here and True. blast I us. think what he's trying to do is prevent our king from leaving the G4 area. I mean, the uh, G G7 pawn. Okay. Mm -hmm. Should we do something like this? No, I. I don't think so because we got to watch. Out. Okay. He can get through. Don't do don't, try, like, don't open it like this. Or what? Dale's original move, which was. I wouldn't open it because then he's he'll do this, Paul. He'll go here and then he'll be here again, and this gives him huge advantage. He, this thing's giving him an advantage like crazy. That pawn there. Mm -hmm. Okay, so how do you how do you confront? Okay, we can do this. Before? See if this would have been the case, it would have been way different. Let's talk about now. Um, so what happens if the rook goes to g4? What do you think, Dale? Do you think that's a good move? Pawn to g5. Where rook? Where? Greg's rook is currently on c4. It's our he move. might move it to g4 on the next move. That's what he's aiming to do. To go over here. Correct. Well, yeah, he could. So that's what I, we're, we're trying to figure out how to stop. If you go here, then he goes here, and then we're even worse. So what do we do? You, you screwed up by not doing that. Hey, let's talk place. about the present, not the past. Okay. The only, the only thing maybe to do is that. No, wait a minute. Hold it. Then he'll take this. Wait, hold it, hold it, hold it. <laughs> no, <laughs> boy. Please don't move those. I'm trying to. The okay, look. You could. You could. <laughs> is it our move? You could go to G to G seven right now. And bring the king around to the king's side. You could go to g7. g7. Yeah. Mm. And trade that pawn off. That pawn is really powerful on f5. And he'll probably do this, you know. But well, if this. he takes it, though, that pawn well, on uh, h6 is going to be left dangling. Just do this. There's right. nothing dangling now. You see? Well, now there isn't, but previously. Mm. That is. In other words, if he does this. Or this. I don't think he will if you push the pawn. If he, if he does push the pawn, that, he'll, he'll probably exchange. If he does that, then you just push the H pawn one, 
And then if he takes the other one, you take well, it with you. Can. I don't know. But I knew this is what. Okay, our time is getting very, very short. Yeah, we, we don't have time. Decision. Okay. I don't I, object to this. We got to do something, and that's a move. Yes. Um, He's I, not there. Where is that rook? It's, what, isn't what, it? Is this rook? Yeah. This rook is here, isn't it? Yes. No, no. Yes, it's on C4. The rook is on C4. Yeah, okay. Well, it is there. I this is it supposed to be the authority that you'll be making mud pies with, and just, you know. Yeah, yeah, leave that one alone. Leave, leave this alone if you need to. Play, play okay. with Janet over here. Excuse me, Janet. Well, how about Whatever. trying G <laughs> G6, you guys? What do you think of G6? Well, whatever it is, got to do it fast. What do I you think of I G6? I can handle G6. What do you think, Will? Um, I think that we can... Yeah, yeah, I think that... I think I think that we can probably get away with it. Okay. Um, yeah, let's give it a try. All right. And I think it's best is here, but let's just go with this. Let's assume this. You know, that's probably what he might do. Okay, we certainly have to, to move a little bit faster from here on out. Yeah, I know we got what? G6. G6? Pretty sure he would change. We need to hit that yeah. clock too, please. Thank you. Whoa, we missed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I don't think this is bad. Does anybody else think this is bad? Right. Well, well it does draw a king away from the center. I just yeah. hit it for him. But he's for advancing great. now. I think, uh, he could get to f5, this, perhaps. Just take. We don't have. And much. get back towards the center. <laughs> take. Okay, we took it right. Everybody agree? Yeah. yeah. Okay, go okay. tell Greg. Yeah, let's just yeah. do it and then discuss. Yeah, now we can discuss. That my worry originally was the pawn on h6. He might it, go it might here and there then for the back. To attack. Yeah, but we protect it. But, but the king needs to move at some point. He can't stay over there. Yeah, he can come here and he can <laughs> And then the rook might come over and attack that well, pawn. Yeah. Or he can go here. No. I don't know. We can go here, guys. Just here. See? Check. What we thought used a long time ago. Then I think we go here, and he goes here, we go here. I don't think that's what's going to happen, though. Maybe well, we'll, we'll find out soon. Look at Paul, we got, we can do this move, too. Remember? Dale, please don't use that word for analysis anymore. It really messes things up. Okay, anyway, wait. Put them back how they were, and then wait for Greg to move. You're right about not using the board. <laughs> it's okay. Well, it looks like Greg is still thinking, so we'll see what he does. Is that the way things work? I guess so. We gotta get our king. Correct. After we take the pawn, that's where we're at. One, two, three. One, two, one, two. Now he's got a majority on the king's side, though. Boy. Which we can stop, maybe. Well, we can chase his rook back too if we have to on the queen side. In fact, we could do. Oh, we got all kinds of things we can do. Okay. We, I, I think uh, the we move. Can win on the queen side. I think moving maybe perhaps the pawn to f5 at some point soon. That'll yeah. restrict the mobility of the rook on that right. Yeah. Rook b4. Oh, okay. Rook He's going to attack b4. Those b4. Rook b4. Yeah, that's yeah. what. Yeah. Okay, so okay, I think we could actually consider this. To no, no, five. then what? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That restricts his movement. I agree, on the I agree, anymore. I agree. That would Go ahead. That, no, but yes, that's a good move because it restricts his yeah. rook from moving to a couple more squares on that on that rank. Right. Oh, like so. Yeah, that'll work. And we're getting ready to swing the C pawn forward as well. How about as soon as it's now he may come anymore. right back to here. In other words, this may just be something he did. And he goes here, and then I guess I again say he might I, try don't, to, I don't like he's here. He's going to try to slip no. behind us. He's like going to try here. to slip yeah. behind the pawns. If we, if he checks us, he's going to slip behind and get behind our pawns. But okay, look at that puts our rook where we can't get his pawns too. Though, see what? 
It blocks we, our roof. If we go pushing, he gets he gets behind it. What if we retreat the roof? Mm. I don't, yeah, I don't think so. But maybe All right. We well, so this is something we could do. He doesn't yet have a pass point. He, he can. Um, we can go like here. Well, That'll I'm, stack our pawns. Now, now currently, yeah. our king is on G yeah, six, exactly. right? That's right. really bad. I guess what we're worried about is if rook checks the king. The this oh, is still right. If the rook right. checks the king, right. and then the king moves, I think the rook the goes back. He thought a good move. Yeah. To the eighth rank or the seventh rank. Yeah. I think he goes here. Okay, he has to go yeah. back because otherwise the rook is going to get behind those pawns. Right. And then he might try to get our. Um, Eight but there's nothing to stop from this. Play, yeah, and that's if he does yeah, this, I hell, we can stand, even <laughs> put the king right again. here again and just and it could be a draw. Force him back and forth. Yeah. Well, okay. Here, move, B5? move the rook yeah. back. Yeah, we black rook. Now our move currently, we need do? to move fast. Is yeah. a pawn to B5. Where did Greg do? Where did Greg do? B5. Huh? He did here, right? Yeah, we didn't do that. We, we kind of went here, might have been better. Okay, this is, this is... B5. B5? Yes. Excuse me. Unless he rook to G4. Rook to G4 check. Yeah, yep. I think we should go king to F7. If we yeah. go to any other square, he's going to get king gets king F7. Uh, yeah, so told him. Cool. Okay. All Greg might be trying to get it. Let's, let's just do that. This We all agreed on that? Yeah. 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 Okay. Yeah, cool. uh, are you still good? Okay. Okay. Uh -oh, so let's go into speed down mode. Down we can go there. So king F7. Before. Before. Okay. Okay, he doesn't want us going All here. Alright, so we got B4. B4. Oh, oh, we're on wait, but not, not B4. Um, Rook B4? Rook to... Uh, yeah, yeah, just... Rook to B4? Not Rook to B4, just Pawn to B4. Sorry pawn about that. Pawn to B4, he's trying to shore up. Okay, so... Okay. Push, push our Pawn to here. We, we might be able to trap his rook for push up on there. So I was thinking F, F5, he gives his rook. H5 and oh, let's calm down. F5. H5. Let's hear what he has yeah, to okay. So um, F5 gives his rook one square to go to, and that's H4. Um, then we could go king to G6. Yeah, we're going to win. I think this is good. Does that, does that, yeah. does anyone see any problems with that? I see well, that there is there being be excellent, there. excellent. Oh, point. he won't. No, a good suggestion by Will. We win. Is that okay? I we're going to win. Perfect. We're going to win. Okay. Stop it. 
People okay. have to think. No, don't touch. Say. He's telling them. So. Okay. So we had we had F five. Well, this is a no-brainer, isn't it, huh? Yeah. Okay, Rook H4. Okay, Rook to H4. Now the king, the king to G6. Okay. So either, yeah, king to G6 or Rook to D6 would defend the pawn. Which one do you guys like better? Oh, let me see. I'm sorry, where's the Rook? rook? Oh, I see. Fall back and defend the pawn. Or, okay. Well, at least with the king move, we're threatening to come. Well, no, the king can't really take it. The yeah. Rook is safe there. Um, I move the king to use the king. I kind of like the Rook move. No, he'll just I kind of do too. Because that at least gives the king a chance to get to the center. I mean, he can't do it right now because the rook needs to protect that pawn. I kind of uh, like the idea too. Okay. But that rook might be able to move a little bit closer to the pawn to the G file, and then the king can move towards the center. This is awesome. So, rook D6? Yeah. Okay. okay. Good. So, we've hemmed in his rook very nicely. This is tiresome. Rook D6. Rook to what? D6. Yeah. Oh, interesting in-game. Interesting, interesting. Okay. Towards, towards now, that means he's going to use side. these pawns to attack with, so... Um, King is D2. <clears throat> now might be a good time. Oh, no, it won't be a good time. This if thing's here, right? Here, I think we can now go here. That's that's a good idea. That's our... We needed that in the first place. Well, Dale, it's, it's 8.30. Are you sure it's not too late for you? Yeah, it's too late, but it's okay. Yeah, move the king. Move the king out. Okay. Do we think so? So yeah, we gotta protect the pawn. We've got the we got the idea of king g six, or since our rook's on d six, it is defending the pawn. We can um, start running our king over to the queen side, but um, I'm not really sure which ones which ones better. That's just one more idea. His rook is. Um, we moved it, didn't we? We moved the king, didn't we? Did we move? No. No, no, we haven't yet. The king isn't there yet. That's a proposed We got to protect this pawn, use this rook in the center. No, I think the king there is a good move. His, his rook can't threaten him right now. Okay, let's And it, it gives our rook some free mobility. I'm going to do it. Yeah, we need so our king to G6. Yes. Cool. Yeah. Okay, and uh, be yeah. sure to wait for him to make his move. We're going to have... Yeah. Mm -hmm. 
sudden you hit camera again. Like that. We we got we can that way. Take take. Our advantage rook. is on his rook, mm -hmm. and we can get that rook for nothing. Upon me. Okay. Do we have a move? Yes. I don't know about that. What did he do? Yeah, that was, that's, yeah, that's what. That's what he did. Okay. What was but it? Now we got a problem. I just moved it there. It so it looks like, what is yeah. it, E5? He's trying to break through. Wait, no, I'm sorry, E4, I apologize. Is this what we're okay. looking at? Okay, right. Now, I was thinking... Here you go, Paul. Move the king. It looks like he's trying to break through the center. Move the king up one, I'd say. Don't take the pawn, whatever you do. Move the king up one. Yeah, it seems... To G5. Why? To because his rook, uh, the rook don't is and then pawn. and no look you move the king to g five he can't push the g pawn if he takes the e to the f then your king takes it the rook's protecting the h pawn I mean that's I don't know hmm. don't don't push the f pawn don't take that um if you the biggest mistake could be taking the e pawn with the f pawn or Moving the F prime to F four, that'd be even worse. Okay, so if we go, if we go king to G five, um, then he could respond and just E takes F five. There is another. King takes F five. There is I'm another. Let him finish his thought, please. Um, and oh. then, and then we'd have a pretty good, a pretty good king position if he did take there. Um, but once again, his rook is going to be somewhat liberated. Maybe there's no yeah, way don't to liberate yeah. that. We rook. do have a, um, we do have a pin on the d3 pawn, but his um, yeah, for the time being, his, his rook can retake on e4 from a move such as f takes e. I'd say, I'd um, say move the king up one. Actually, I I don't think f takes e is that bad. If we take it, yes, he takes back with the rook. Oh, but he's got an isolated pawn in the center, and his king is behind it. And yeah, and then the rook signs in the e file, and our okay. b file, and we, we've had. And then another yeah, another really, quick I'm idea I had this. was uh, king g5, yeah, like Gail was saying, with the idea of pushing f4 if he does not take. And that position favors white. It's true. The rook might still be able to attack that h6 pawn. Mm -hmm. Okay, so we got about eight minutes. But then pawn up. How about e one? Instead of the king move, how about we move? We push the pawn to e. Uh, our, no, our, we can't do that. No, I'm sorry. Our I'm advantage sorry. is that we got his rook. Almost trapped, and I say to move and keep pushing on that. He he does not want to isolate his D pawn because the two pawns are good. Yeah. Okay. And he probably won't take the pawn. The move's probably going to be well, the G four. That's a loser. Yeah, I was um, um, I was talking about this with the idea. Right. Can and if he gets to G4 okay, with the other pawn, then, then he's going to break through. Takes, takes. Okay. I think Will's idea is a pretty good one. He's recommending yeah. king to G5 in yeah, an anticipation of oh, wait, F4. Yeah, right. We're all wait. king to, is it king to G6 first? Because I think he was Don't was take the pawn. There? Taking that pawn is a yeah, huge he, mistake. No, he's already there. This stroke was right there. 
Ta taking the pawn is a big mistake. Okay. Uh, we're not talking about taking the pawn. We're talking about advancing the king yeah. to uh, g5 well, in anticipation of pawn. pushing to f4. Go for it. Okay. okay. I think we're right. What if he takes? What if he takes the up pawn? Then, then you uh, just yeah. g5. Uh, yes. Yeah. Go here, and then if, if we there's don't a rook take, there. On, uh, if we don't take. Yeah. Uh, we're very low on time. Okay. It must have been a really exciting game. Deal with see. Chess at its best. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I take the one. Okay. So, okay, so he took the pawn. Okay, so we, yeah, let's try to back. real quick. Now. So let's can we, we don't have to take back. Oh yeah, we do. Well, have yes, to we do. <laughs> yeah, we do. We yeah, yeah. So take it back. Yes, king takes. Two king takes. Uh, and that the rook is protecting that h6 yeah. pawn. Okay, now before we take back... King to e3. King to e3. Okay, he wants to play on this side. <clears throat> now we got the troubles now. Okay, I think. He can't. Um, oh, brother. Okay, some problems. Uh, um. Maybe like um, rook to g6. I'm not sure. It's mm. not a bad idea. It's a good defensive move. I think it's, I think it may be an excellent move. Okay. I can't think of anything yeah, better like right now. That's okay. good. That's good. So, okay. 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 And rook to g6. Yep. And then we could stick it on. Um, we could stick it on. No, we can't do that. Rook G6. Rook to G6. Yeah. Blank. G6. Good move. I'm so glad I got more time than you. <laughs> When it's good to know those looking for end games. Yeah. Gets that center pawn. Wait, where is our king currently? Rook it's, two. It's not there. It's on. It's on f five. We could go f five. Put our, our king. king yeah, rook two. Rook to g four. 
Our king belongs on F5. No. And then he gets the pawn. F5. F5. Uh, F5. Then his king will go and get our center yeah. pawn. That's yeah, what he's Yeah, yeah you're right. Okay. And then we get a pawn. That's correct. That's where our king is, right? That's where our king is yeah. now. Okay. So what are you suggesting? I'm sorry, Will? Ooh, um, maybe rook to g4 with the idea of just taking out his two pawns and trying to push our pawn up. Look, in um, this, if this is the situation, what's wrong with that? Don't, because he'll take our rook, we take his rook, he moves his king in, and he's got our center pawn. Well, then we we're going to get, we're going to get his move. That's Flanks. not what we're going <laughs> to do. Him. Don't do that move. That's a Wait losing a move. Also, we have like one minute on Greg's clock. Okay. <laughs> Wait, so how about this? How about if we push the pawn first to h5? That's H5 good. H5 seems good. good. And that's then good. we bring the rook yeah, down. Yeah, that's right. good. There we go. We Away got him. Because he can't do nothing. You win for us, <laughs> about 20 moves in front of us. So does the game end when we drop on time on our clock? Because we've got like something like three, or we got like four minutes. Yeah, I'll give you a hold in and, and I'll uh, give you four minutes. Four minutes? Cool. It's just sp splitting hairs that we're doing here. Splitting hairs. What did you tell him about no. the time? He put less time. He put, he put, he put more time on because we have more time. Oh, okay. Rook to h4. How about king g5? Try yeah, to draw. king g5. No, then the <laughs> other king gets in the center. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. Or just how about rook to g5? Because uh, we'll, then we'll get checked on h, h5. Jesus. With the rook. No, rook to g5. No, the then he takes oh, the pawn. No, no. Okay. Stop. He can't take the pawn. Yeah, rook to, rook to g5. He can't then? take it. What pawn can he take? I thought you were going to yeah. put the rook on g4. Yeah, that, that's also that's what I was good there. That's good there. So rook G, doing. rook G five. Okay, now we can move in on the queen side and win. Okay, that looks that looks good. Rook yeah, G or five. well, the rook can get over there. Well, this is too much. Rook G five. G five. Yeah. This way. Exciting game for the TV audience. Look at the G five. A3. A3. Okay, he's changing. I got to go back. He's he's trying to shore up on the queen side. Three. Okay. Okay, well, I just need, I need to see what, what the current situation. I'm is. sorry. That's okay. Um. What is it? Current situation is exciting. Like I got a suggestion. Move the A3. So he moved A3. All right. No. He's he's mm -hmm. being a good boy. Can't do um. That. Three. Hey, Do we, we got a pawn right on now? A7. We have a pawn on A7, black. 
Yeah, we can use our use our pawn move. Uh, black go pawn A6. on A7. Black pawn on A7. Yeah. It's currently on A7. Yes. This is here. Okay. okay. What do we got? Um. Is this? We got. We're going to end. We could end up in Zugzwag here, guys. Yeah. Um. The, then he's going to bring his king in. Then he brings his king in, and yeah. then we're happy. Then that. Uh, that's true. Then he gets our pawn there, though. Yeah, exchange, king takes pawn. Yeah, yeah we're going to go... We don't want that. A6, then he'll push H3, and right. then we don't have... um. And then his king's going right. to get in on E4. All right, yeah. you're right. I think. He's trying to get our king where it belongs. We have, like, two minutes. F5 is our king. Okay, so I think the move for now is A6. That's pretty, okay. that's pretty well, Let's try to think in the meantime. A6 is good. A6, yeah. and let's think about our next move, like, right off the bat. Uh, well, okay. Wait a minute. We got a chance to win over there. Well, we got to move now because we're running out of time. Okay. So, what's what's the next move? A six. Uh, we're getting down to tweaking. <laughs> <laughs> we're getting down to tweaking. Uh, Fine points of chess, chess endings. Three. Okay, he's going. He doesn't have oh, okay. Three. He's coming back. Okay. Oh, oh, boy, three. this is good. Stop. Oh, man. Oh, he's, yeah, he's uh, using triangulation. Um, he's going to, I know what he's going to try to do. He's going to, I bet he moves D4. Okay, so um, honestly, I think we have to move our king back to e6. No, how, well, yeah, how, about, I, the I rook? Is how about the rook right now? Put the rook. On G four, no, we, no, the we just get key. checks the pawn, and then we, and then we oh, lose, right. lose the game. Yeah. So king to E six, I think, is our best. I think back. you're right. No, I think no, you're no, right. No. I think. You know, that no, king E six, rook takes pawn. Pretty damn scary. His rook can't take. Okay, king king E six. E six. Yeah. Also, do you want to draw? Oh, uh, um, maybe I have a little bit of advance here. Okay. Wait a minute, he's gained position right now. No, I was thinking king to d6. Then we can swing I'm forward. Sorry, is that what he Hold did? It. Yes. He's gained position. King okay. to d6? I was thinking king to d6. Hold we it. Why don't we trade rooks now? Because if we move the rook, we lose the pawn, Dale. All right. Uh, no, it's home king, king to right. d6. No, we don't. We check him. We check. Oh. We check him. Okay. Wait, wait. Will, come back. Will? Will! Come back. No, no. Oh, the king was here. Yeah, I apologize. Okay. Okay, sorry about that. Thank you. 
Yeah, rook to, rook to g4 check. Rook to g4 check? Yeah. Oh, good. I was hoping for that move. H takes G4, of course. Price. Well, now there's really nothing else to do here. Yeah, we're also we're also down on time apparently. Um. Okay. So here's our really, really, really. I think no, to take. Wait a second. Wait a second. We exchange rooks, and now it's our move. Rook takes, pawn takes. Oh, wait, so now it's we takes. Sorry. It. Yeah, it's, yeah, it's so he went d4. Let, we got to take d4, guys. I apologize. Oh, yeah. It's, I'm getting it's, all backwards. It's <laughs> we got to we gotta take d4 we're in my own opinion. Yeah, I think we. Oh, God. I think he's won. I think he's actually can get in. No, he. he yeah, I think so, too, but let's oh, take. Our king four. currently is on e6. Let's take d4. Oh, six? Yeah. You sure? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We gotta yeah, take that we, can, that we can take, and we can take the opposition every single move. Are you ready? Okay. If we if we have the opposition, if we're there, okay. We don't we're have. Not, okay. We're not in bad shape. Can you take? Okay, pawn takes pawn. Takes pawn. We don't have time check. now. We gotta remember. And, and then king the king will take the pawn. Then we can yeah, move so our king. Pawn takes. Pawn takes pawn. That's what. All right. So pawn takes pawn. King takes pawn. All righty. And then our okay. response. King D6, offer draw. King D6 and offer draw. Yeah. D6, draw. Okay. Yeah. And then also, um, we do offer a draw. Your if if, if flag is down, though, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it is, unfortunately. No, I'll have to think about it. Okay. Yeah, our like our flags been down for about five mm. minutes. Oh. But uh, it's uh it's uh, we pretty much pretty much gotta draw those, so Yeah, I think the clocks were way out of sync. I'm not sure what happened there. Yeah. Yeah. I should have mis misplayed this a little bit. Must have been a better way. Then duh. Hmm. It's an interesting way to end the game, okay, but winning, a, winning on time, but techni technically I'll take a draw. Okay. Alrighty. It's a strange way to end the game. Yeah, sounds like he accepted it. Good. Right, Greg says it'll take a draw. Oh! 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 Okay. Yeah, okay. I'm fine. All right. So we got a draw. Yeah. Boy, my heart's in good shape for right, yeah. dead by now. <laughs> All right. So I thought. Um, Wasn't that awesome? I thought. I thought one of um one of the best moves of the game was bishop to h3, getting rid of that g2 bishop. That was a good idea. Um, yeah. I thought that was really good. Hey, Greg. Strange way to end the game. Greg, we we got a draw, man. God, it was. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, 
somewhere somewhere else along the line, I thought it was technically a point ahead. And when he went went to look to Jesus was check, I must thought I was winning at that point. Then realized that uh, time I got was pulling us down. You were gonna get. You can't close. You, you uh, went I, on I this side, Greg, and we went on this it's side. It's kind of a weird ending. Winning on time for drawing. <laughs> oh, the clock was all goofed up. And we did have a little slip in the early part of the game with that pawn fort possibility. Greg, we had yeah, actually, I know. We actually it, it was had a that. Really, uh, we had this much time. It was left. a very really interesting. For real. A very really interesting judgment day of. I could have forked you. Uh, of course, I saw yeah. that I could fork you. Did you yeah. see? Did you see? But it would turn. It would turn. Nice. Yeah, it turn. yeah it we I would have come out ahead. Just, two pawns for a piece in a, such a crazy game. Remember, I at thought the maybe beginning? I could just technically yeah. opposition you out. rather than it would have been just uh, nuts. Now we looked at that and we were going to take back with the queen. Yeah, yeah. exchange. Everything was going to break loose. It was yeah. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> we would have won.